Yeah, I just hit yeah. like 62 today, maybe 63, 62 early, earlier. Yeah. It's been way too many hours. Yeah, sleep. My body's sleep falling apart. Good. Yeah, uh, we have like two 70s in the guild and like three or four like 60 plus and uh, we have like uh, like uh, 15 like level 40-ish. So it's going like here and there like we're like I said, we're not like hardcore like crazy like in the raid. Uh, the the thing is that I'm not a guy that will go for the parts and like ask you to be full consumable every damn freaking raid and everything. Like I want to be like we're, we're doing the the, the the last content. Well, at least get the flask, you know, like minimum shit. Like get a mm -hmm. flask and I, what I want is like the people. Like I don't mind if you're like they're say like warrior DPS or like shitty ass fuck. Well, I don't want you to go uh, arms warrior for for raiding, you know. Like go fury, go the gold build and like. Do what you have to do and do your rotation probably. Sadly, now we can see everybody rotation, everybody spam, everybody shit with all the the tool we get in WoW. But just like play your cast efficiently, like mm -hmm. I don't uh, like don't take the shit build, take the good build, you know. That that's the only thing I wanted to ask. And what are your uh, what are your class by any chance? Uh, I'm a DK. I'm still not sure if I'm gonna tank or not. Um, yeah, I'm a druid. That's interesting. DK, there's too much. <laughs> like, yeah. if, uh, I, I, like, it's not yeah, bad but DPS, but like, it doesn't. Yeah, it's it's good. But, it doesn't uh, bring additional be, buffs. Like, yeah. yeah. What kind of roles do you guys need, or is it just everything? Yeah, like right now, I'm just telling everybody, like, look. Like play what you want, because if you don't enjoy the the, the 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 character you're playing, you know, like don't play the game. Like I'm a type of guy like that, you know. Like play a character you want to enjoy, level and everything. Like right now we have a DK that's uh, max spec. We have um, another DK that's max spec. That is 70. Uh, no, that's a warlock 70. A warlock 70. We have a priest level 58, 60, something like that. We have me on 362. That's pretty yeah, rare, because no it seems like nobody's playing Warlock or Priest. Or Healer at all. Like, Healer at all, there is none. After that, there is, uh... I think we got a Shaman. A Shaman level, uh... 63, 64, something like that. Kallax in the guild. After that, the uh, Cess, like, is all he's gonna probably, like... He, he got, like, a... Since he's DK, he has, like, a, a Rogue 55. Uh, Benny is a pally, he's leveling like as prod, but he's gonna be healer in the end. So we have a we have Aridric that's like 50 or about to get 50. He's gonna uh, go uh, prod pally. Uh, we have a guy that's going DK2. Uh, Do you know is he tanking? The we have a pally tanking. We don't have a DK yet tanking. Uh, <laughs> We have a priest, like the that's a real friend, a real life friend of Benny. Uh, he's like 50 or around that. He's a priest. You don't know if he's going uh, shadow or healer yet. Like he's okay. Or like I don't think he mind. That's the thing. <laughs> he just like wants to level for now and. Uh, yeah, discipline uh, looks fun. I've never done it, but it looks really yeah. fun. Yeah. Yeah. We have I think a warrior. Uh, yeah, Syndrab is a warrior. He's following me in level like. We're always like five level apart, more or less. So yeah, Leering's uh, Kelly. Uh, like like I said, like there was people like I want a spot in the raid, and he's not even level twenty yet, you know. Like, mm -hmm. and I, I like, and we don't, and I don't want to, like I made a guild in classic, classic. You know, we had we we had two hundred player, and we had like player like rushing to the top like crazy and like oh it's the 40 man run come on come on recruit recruit and i i like i got forced to do that and i don't want to do that i want to make the player like of the guild like because when those player like play their three hours per day instead of the guy that play all the time you know because there is player that uh, don't work uh, and i don't do you but it's life you know you, you play the game it's your choice i don't mind like i have a I have a girlfriend, I have two kids, like, one, uh, two years old, and the other, like, uh, nine months old, so, like, and I work 40 hours a week, so, you know, like, I'm playing WoW, but, like, real life is first, but, uh, and if I can play only three hours per night, well, that's three hours per night every night, but those guys play three hours per night every night like me, 
but the guys that are like rushing through the game well in the end they might be, end up like oh it's stupid the game and they stop so i don't want to undermine the player that always online and play three hour and when they come to ratings so i don't want to say to them like fuck you too you know we, we, we switch with another player so i want to check how it goes so that's why i like 10 man first and we're gonna see when it release really and uh for right now like anyways the only main focus i'm telling you guys like get 70 get your profession maximum and get fucking money out of hell you know yeah that's we'll probably have that by next week i don't know <laughs> we went way <laughs> too hard i mean it was very yeah, fun we did it on purpose yeah. but yeah we'll but probably it's cool. get like, that I, I, kind of chill i i took i took three day off you know three or four day off and it was labor day this week i think something mm -hmm. like that yeah Monday. so i quit yeah exactly so uh like i had like six day off like when my kids were like in the napping like i was like oh, let's go play a while like crazy you know but uh that's uh that's a, ru a rush that i did and i had to take like day off to play the rush you know and get it ahead of the curve but that's me you know but not everybody did that i know there is like three or four in the guild that are like i'm seeing them every night and they're like three uh like 35 right now but like at the end of the four weeks, well, they would maybe will be like 61, 62. Like, they will be, they will get 70, and they are steady player, you know. Yeah, there's plenty of time. It's it's, it's too early to commit to stuff. I mean, and, we don't know. And, you know. We don't know who's gonna make it to wrath. It's this is only pre patch. Mm -hmm, exactly. So, and some player are playing this this server right now because they have nothing to do on their main when it releases. You know, that's another thing too. Yeah, that is the thing. If they can get on their mains, a lot of those mains are queues are even worse than this. Yeah, like yeah. six hour queues. And I'm just tired of the queue. I get screw like yesterday at five o'clock, uh, at five thirty, uh, when uh, like my computer is my basement, I was playing with my kids and I was uh, just moving my character so I don't go AFK and get the queue, you know. And I was moving here like every twenty minutes just to move the character to not get screwed, you know, and every time I, I came I was like and like Benny texts me and he's like dude Kura like uh, make sure you're in game uh, you, you queue there's an hour queue already and it was like uh, 5.45 since I was like ah don't worry it's been 10 minutes I just moved my character I'll be alright at 5.50 they, they made a mass disconnect for everybody and I had to queue back for an hour 30 I was like what the fuck man that's like <laughs> uh, that pissed me off for real like it's good because the server will be hype up, but uh. Alright, my kid is crying. Be right back. Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. Ah, yes. And yeah, uh, me and uh, the Beast are French Canadian, so uh. Sometimes when we speak, we're, we sound like a little bit uh. Not uh, American, you know. Well, we're American, but uh. Not the uh, United States American. Wait, you sound French, you know. <laughs> That's what I sound sadly. What what uh, so you you're in Canada? Yeah, fresh uh, from Quebec. Quebec? Okay, yeah, yeah. Oh damn, I'm pissed at the queue for real. Um. Yeah, but uh, I'll I invite you. And like I think we don't have a lot of people online right now because of the queue. Like players, there there was a lot of player like us that were just like playing during the evening and. Uh, Oh, sorry. Now the kid is raging. Be right back. It won't be long. Yeah, I don't know if you see me just continuously dying over here. I see you're in Iron Forge. Yeah, I've died like five, six times. So what are you trying to do? Um, I have to get, I have to fish a rare fish out of the pond. Oh, oh, right. You did say that. Yeah, and it, the this this fish last fish took like six hundred. So, don't expect me to do anything for quite a while. I don't know why this is the first thing I'm doing when I'm 70, but it is. I think it's mainly I want to just do all the fishing achievements first. Plus it levels my fishing for me. And I'm at like a 150 out of 225, so I got, you know, a lot of room to get levels. Right, yeah. This could take hours and hours and hours, but hopefully not. Uh, 
how am I gonna max my profession? I really don't wanna. I don't wanna. We'll just make money farm. and then. And I guess that's the only way. Yeah, I mean, I would. I think paladins like it's gonna be worth it maybe just for the farming money. I'm not gonna do it, but since you like alt, you get this level of paladin or something. No, if I think I'd, I'd level a DK first. It do, can you farm with I'm them? I'm back. You can farm with anything. Nah. I don't think I really have any AoE. I mean, I do, I'm but back. it's not like... Hey. It's not like amazing. Uh, yeah, so uh, I think I, I forgot to, got the, to get the, uh, your... Uh, you're a druid, but which kind of druid? Healer, DPS, tank? Um, I'll either be either balance or a resto. I'll either, yeah, I'll either be a boomkin or a resto. I don't, I don't, I don't really want to go feral. Oh, it's cool. It's cool. I have nothing against that. We don't have boomkin yet, so we have shock dart. Is saying that he wants to go there, but I've seen him like once online, so I think uh, he tried. And yeah, like I said, I think players are like getting pissed every night that they cannot get in the queue, you know, because it's too long. Mm -hmm. Oh man, I feel them so bad. Yeah, like if you're on the west coast and you work, it's impossible. Mm -hmm. And even the east coast, if you don't plug at like 5.30, uh, 5 6, you're screwed for like until 10, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I got home at like 5.30 and I had a 45 minute queue. So yeah, that's mainly it. Like, I, w I don't want to make a guild when we have like 400 player in the guild and like 4, uh, four raid, you know? Like, we don't want to, to do that uh, big major guild. Like, I want to have like a more friendly environment with the players and uh, yeah. Kid doesn't sleep. Sleep for fuck's sake. Ah, uh, sorry. Kids. Yep. So uh, if you have any question, you can feel free to uh, PM me or the beast, and uh, we'll gladly answer that. Yeah, that's fine. We're just kind of, you know, so we're kind of looking for a guild, so we're just kind of popping into different places and, you know, getting a feel of what's going on before we. So we're not committing to anything right now. We're just trying to, you know, see where we might fit in. Okay. Well, that's cool. That's mainly uh, what we have. We're leveling <laughs> like and mostly everybody else. Um, um, that's about it. We're trying. Yeah, yeah, we appreciate it. Yeah. We appreciate you coming on and talking to us. Do you know, like, what you might try to twist the guild into? Like, some are, like, achievement guilds. Some are, like do other random stuff guilds yeah but uh that's what we want to do we want to raid and uh, that's the main objective and uh with the raiding well uh, you know uh that's uh what we want and yes we can do the achievement when we clear the content i don't mind like trying to do the achievement after we you know do it first and then we'll see like that's uh like I said I'm a guy that's like uh, straightforward one step at a time. You know? I got babies so it's like one baby step at a time. <laughs> I don't want to rush or burn anything and like, all right we have like 370 I'm gonna recruit like uh, 25 more members like instantly to rush to do it and say so fuck the other members and I'm gonna take it like smooth. For real if you're a hardcore player that's like uh want to parse and want to uh you know. Uh, uh, push like uh, all right we want to clear it the first night and then do heroic the same night and clear a fast cleaning and everything well i would say that's not the place sadly like we want to do it efficiently fast the, the best we can but i don't want to you know rush and have people yell because they don't have uh they don't have like all full their consumables and shit like that like i will i will ask for enchant full and everything but Damn it, my kid doesn't want to fucking sleep. I'm tired, it's been an hour. Sorry. So. Uh, I know how that is. Oh man, he doesn't, he's two years old. Like, he's two two years and uh, 
and a, and a half and jeez he can't even get fucking asleep properly in under an hour an hour 30 every fucking night you don't understand that's like uh, yeah I, I, yeah mine are older now but I, I did go through that phase oh man he don't shut up I'll be right back Yeah, so I haven't been killed yet, so this is promising. And there's another okay. guy fishing right next to me. So he hasn't called the cops. So, where are you? Are you in chat? Uh, I just joined the Navy. Yeah, but like, where from? Yeah, from chat. Okay. Um, let me look. I think it's only Iron Forge, and... Yeah, so I think if you can go to Undercity, um, like, queue up and then go to Undercity, and then see if the quest giver is there. So I believe it's only an Iron Forge and the Undercity. Because they're the closest places. Okay. Because that might mean that he's there now? I don't know. Uh, I mean, quest it could be off. It definitely can be.
Oh, you got living bombed. Yeah, the Alliance are defending. Uh, yeah, we're getting steamrolled. Yeah, the problem for me in AV is that I enjoy it, but I don't think I'd like spamming it for honor. Yeah, I, I mean, I don't plan to spin it. Um, I mean, I don't want to spin it over and over. Well, you're getting the whole set, right? <sighs> yeah, but I really, I don't know. See, I don't think I could do it that much. I may not be able to either. I don't know, Especially you're, a, like you're a grinder, man. Especially if we're gonna lose a lot. So, uh, you guys does have any got any other question? I don't think at this time. I don't know what to ask. <laughs> so that's good. That means I answer all of your questions. That's perfect. I feel satisfied in a way. Do you so know yeah, where I, I am it. right now in the game? One hundred and three minutes left. The queue is at forty-seven hundred. I would say forty-eight. So uh, that's how the game works these days. Yeah, sadly, game cannot be a, a big sir, a big enough server, you know. So, um, all right. So uh, I'm gonna go watch a show, I guess. I'm waiting. If you have any question. <laughs> okay. So, well, well, thanks for day. yeah. Th thanks for coming on. Yeah, no problem. So, what do you think? Um, I don't know. Seems okay. And I don't know. I guess I didn't want to ask if I mean are a lot of them French Canadian? I don't know. That might be a little rough. <laughs> wow. I mean, you know, just... Do you not know what he's saying, or what? Yeah, but it's, it's a little... Because I'm bad, I don't understand people, but I could. I knew what he was saying. No, I could understand him too. Do you just not like people from Quebec? <laughs> I Some other dudes, it's level 14, no mages fishing with me. I forgot that I can see trade chat from here. Oh, really? Yeah, that's cool. Fish. Nice. It's called. Uh, they, they're always like 50 fish, 100, 250 fish. 
but the achievements actually just get 250 items. So I don't I don't like the name of it. Oh, I should have looked. There's there's nothing. Oh wait. No, there's. Sorry, no, I don't see anything in Undercity. Where where it has the exclamation point? I oh. mean, let me see. I think it. The, the only thing I see is is an, a PVP quest and. Uh, oh no, it's the wrong. Wrong quest. Maybe it's in Thunder Bluff. Maybe it's in Orgrimmar. Why is it only in Iron Forge? Um, let me turn off trivial quests. Look around. Just be, so it might just be bugged. Yeah, it's in um, Tedrasil, Iron Forge, and Stormwind. But well, it's that's not yeah. anywhere else. Um, I guess I'll just look at Reddit to see if maybe they'll say something. It was like, oh, it's released. Though I don't think they really post that much. They just talk about getting banned. So yeah, so I don't know, the, this guild, um, what do you think? Well, I don't know how to tell if it's too early or not. Yeah, uh, that's part of the problem, you know. <laughs> Someone has a post. Remember when we all worried that the zombie invasion would make the game unplayable? I, and then his <laughs> comment is, I can't tell I'm still in the queue for the next three hours. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, today is supposed to be the cockroaches, if you know about that. Uh, kind of. They, I think it goes down to five minutes or something like that. And, um, and there's somewhere else. I don't remember where. Do you know what a song flower is? What it is? Or yeah. I don't know what it is. I know where it is. Where is it? Those are the ones in, um, Carlos that you used to get the, the buffs for the raids. Oh, okay, that's why. The corrupted song flowers. Not Feralis, um, Bellwood. I guess you can still use the buff? Um, I suppose. God, so many death lights. I know it's not a surprise, but god damn. There's not, there's not that many, actually. Well, I mean, in AV, in my AV, there oh, is. AV, yeah, yeah. But on the server, so, there on this server, there's not many yet. No, Just not yet, because people are still leveling. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so they opened up a new server for people to transfer to. It's Aranicus. Which is 
probably just some kind of dead server. Yeah, yeah, probably some dead server. So now it'll be not dead, which is cool. I mean, yeah, some people may do it. It's just like moving whole guilds and stuff is kind of rough. How does that work for like guild banks and stuff? Does that stuff transfer? Mm, I don't think so. I think you can't yeah, be mean, in a guild. It's just like so you can't be know. in an arena team. Yeah, so I mean, I, I don't know how you do that. Like if you're in a guild and you, your guild wants to move because there's a queue, I mean, how do you do that? Oh, well, you just put it in people's banks and then you move and then, because your bank moves over. The whole bank goes. Yeah, but the guild bank, yeah, but the guild bank, if you have space for all that. Well, there should be at least 25 people. With bags, you know. Like that just seems annoying, you know? I mean, I don't know. You got like 25 people each with like 10 bag slots or whatever. Yeah, well, you're just you gonna hand it. them out to your guild members and hope that stuff doesn't go missing and crap, and then um, to I coordinate mean, they're all guild that. Guild members for like a, a reason. A waste of time. Not a waste of time. That's a, that's that's. This should be a better way. Uh oh. Do, 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 do. Agrand is saying that there's a lot of misinformation going around, which is true. We have disabled. About what? Um, he didn't say, but he's going to try to explain it. We have disabled new character creation and incoming pay transfers to the U.S. and EU mega realms, and they will remain locked indefinitely. Um, I thought they already locked some of them. I think it was only Firemaw. But but now they locked like Fairlina. There was a. Well, I don't have the post up right now, but they locked like six of them now. I mean, honestly, they should have done that like a while ago. Well, yeah. Um, let's see. Uh, they're monitoring other things into Mega Realm territory. Um, may do so with little to no warning. Very reassuring. Um, free transfers have been successful, but we need more folks to move on. Do, do, do. He is thanking all the people that have moved. If you're considering moving to one of those locations, I advise doing so soon before they become too full, as we will endeavor to end transfers before we will allow them to queue. I don't know what that means. What does that mean? As we will endeavor to end transfers before we allow them to queue. And we may do so... Oh, okay. So they're saying if you were originally on the server, you get in the queue faster than all the other transfers. I think. I don't really know. Yeah, um, I sense that it's not obvious. For a bit more specifics around these destination realms' health, let's look at Sulfurus. Prior to last week, this realm had a low concurrency at around a half to a third of the size of a 2008 realm. In the past week, this realm has seen almost. 40,000 incoming transfers with hundreds more still occurring per hour. These incoming transfers um, have made the very robust and in fact nearly full realm that is right now around four times the size of a full 2008 realm. So okay, well, let's do the math. So before they were half to a third. So let's say they were half of a 2008 realm. They got 40,000 people now they're four times. So 40,000 divided by four is 10,000. So before they had like 4,000 people. Now they have 44,000 people. Did I do that math correct? Uh, yeah, I think so. So they gained 10 times their population. I don't know. It seems kind of weird. 
fact is, however, it isn't enough on its own to fix the situation on the realms, such as Benediction and Fairlina. Now that Sulfurus and Mograine are starting to trend upwards, filling up on themselves, we need to look at other solutions and other potential destinations. As a result, we've implemented a new free character move solution, specifically target Benediction, Fairlina, and Grobulus. In the US, for now, we haven't forgotten about the EU. You can read about this thing about Aranicus. So yeah, they just open that shit up. How so? Oh yeah. So, so the realms that got restricted. Oh, he didn't link to that correctly. Come on. Uh, Benediction, Fairlina, and Grobulus are locked. Yeah. Okay. I said that. Um. As Sulfurus has proven, free character moves can f can and do result in a positive play experience to the destination realm. But I don't know. I don't think that's true. I think now they're too big. I mean, they're not too big, but I feel like they're kind of too big. If it's four times the size of a 2008 realm, it sounds a bit too big. Yeah, for sure. We again strongly encourage you to take available free character moves. If you want to jump and join Sulfurus and Mograine, we'll be ending them very soon. It's tomorrow at noon, by the way, if you do want to move your characters. Uh, um, I don't have to worry about it. Why not? Well, I'm just saying, if you can move them for free. Like, if, if you think you want to do it, you just do it. And, you know. Wait, move what characters? These characters? No. Like, if you're on Fairlina. Which oh, I know you have that oh. one dude. At least one yeah, dude. Well, I'm, not, <laughs> I'm not gonna move that one person. I, I don't care. It looks like I might do it. Because right now I have two on Fairlina and two on. Uh. Sulfurus. So I could bring them back together on Sulfurus. Or I could leave them in two different servers. I mean, I just, I don't know. I just don't have, I'll never be able to play all those. Well, yeah, well, if you want to consolidate that, or do I don't know. I mean, I, if, I, if anything, I'll delete them. What? What do you mean delete them? You can't delete characters. That's like 200 hours. Oh, what's my slash blade? Uh, one day, two hours, 30 minutes. So basically in one day, what? In one day, one hour, and six minutes, exactly, I got to 70. With professions and fishing and all that shit. Wait, wait not one day. Oh, that's... <laughs> you were going to say one day, I'm like, what no, are you yeah. talking about? No, I did. And I got, I got to 70 in one day, in six minutes. From 69? Uh, from 55. Oh, fi oh, oh, yeah, yeah, okay. One day, one hour, six that minutes. That makes sense. I'm fucking a speed runner, my man. Yeah, it took you fucking a like a week or whatever. Damn. I mean, really? I mean, my mine is well, three days, twenty hours, but that's not that's a fuck straight. Ton of days. Well, I know, cause you're like, yeah, yeah, we were just chilling. You were doing I did some a lot of I did a couple hours of AV, yeah, so I could probably do it in two days. But I don't know, solo, I don't know if I could do it that quick. Not on a PvP server. I have no idea. I guess if I dungeon grind, it might be fast. It would have taken me If I was a healer. Forever. The Mega Realms in the US and EU are also full. Layers are not the solution. We'll start with the easiest and most clear-cut statement. Uh, don't queue me, or I'll just leave. I can't leave. Can you unkeep Oh, me? I didn't mean it. I'm hiding it. I think we should be good. If this somehow takes me out, I'm a mauled. I mean, it won't be that bad, honestly. But I, I just hit the wrong button. Yeah, hey, that's fine. Okay, I can leave the uh, queue, I so we're it. good. I canceled it. I canceled it. Okay. I got right back in. That would be the biggest fucking troll in the world. If there was no way for me to leave the queue. I'd have like a minute and a half you're to find forced. the fish. And then, and then uh, I'll do it while you're away, and then you join, and then you're AFK, and you get banned. Why would I be away? 
Well, well, I'll wait till like you're going for food or something, and then I'll queue us up. Oh, okay. I see what you're saying. Damn. Um, the mega realms in the ESU that are queuing are completely full. This statement is an is the absolute state of things, and there's no additional capacity we can add to these realms to allow more players or reduce queues. I feel like that is just not true. I don't know. I don't like. Mean, I, th I don't think that there is a capacity in this year for servers. When you look at other MMOs that are gigantic, like, I, f I feel like it's like not what, true. What's, what MMO is gigantic? Well, I mean, all those, like, uh, the Amazon ones, you know. Uh, uh, yeah, but I don't think, like, Amazon has multiple servers. It's not, like, one server. I don't know how big they are. There were so many people on those servers. Like, I was watching some streams, and there was people everywhere. Yeah, but that doesn't mean that there's, like, 40,000 okay. people on it. I would say that the technology has improved in 14 years to allow more than 10 times yeah. the people oh, on the server. Yes, but you realize this is not this is not their newest client. This is like an emulation. Well, then fucking make it better. I'm well, saying they, they could recode shit. They, I'm saying it's not impossible for there to be more people. Yeah, There's gotta the whole, be a way. The whole reason they did this is they could do it cheap. They could just emulate it on the yeah, yeah, I get the it. Legion client. They're not gonna. They don't want to spend money on this. That was the whole point. This but when they say there's there's no way to do it, I don't believe it. That's what I'm well, saying. Well, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Absolutely, like that. Yeah, it makes no sense. But yeah, logically, they they can't do anything about it. One common suggestion we get is to just add more layers. Uh, we understand that doesn't work. Um. Layers don't add the capacity. They're classic specific solution. Um, Black Rock Mountain congregation casting spells. This functions in some contrast to. Oh wait. Um, this functions in some contrast to the sharding system in Modern World of Warcraft uses, which basically does the same thing but spins up additional shards on a per zone per area basis. Yeah. Like, Sharding is mini layering, right? Um, I don't know the exact of them. One of them is like continents, I think, and one's like zones or something. Yeah, I think layers are continents, and shards are zones. I think. Neither, something like that. Neither of these systems increase realm capacity. Realm capacity is dictated by the number of connections to the service itself can handle. Um, every time a player connects to a realm. That connection interacts with the numerous services systems, blah, blah, blah. Game fetches data. Um, when the total number of connections to a realm's database and services reaches a certain number, the service will degrade and fail on multiple levels, leading to symptoms like severe auction house lag or outages, chat performance degradation, or lag when attempting to loot items. So those right there are ideas that people already know. So like apparently if you play on um what are some of the EU servers? Um I don't know. It's not Firemoth. People are saying there's like a server in EU and it's just fucking broken. It takes two minutes at least to loot an item. Like you're literally I guess you're just locked into looting the item. It takes minutes to loot. Individually. So that's why they put that specifically there. That shit's fucking broken. Right? So, like, that server has queues and it's fucked. Like, you, you can't even play on it. I, I'm surprised people haven't, like, posted videos of this, so I'm kind of skeptical that, like, it's true. But a lot of people are saying it, but I don't know. I don't know why I haven't seen videos of this, like, shit. Laggy server. Um... Never in WoW's history has the capacity of realms been as high as they are now. Maybe that's true. Maybe because they're mega servers. Are, are they and are they comparing that to retail? Does that include retail? Because isn't that kind of sad? That the no. classic boys are breaking their servers. No, because retail has so many servers. That I think that's true. A mega server. Because think about it, like on a, on a on North America. I, I don't know. Like, what do you play like? Fairlina, right? Isn't that like the server? I don't know. Um, 
All I can think of is Feralina that like people want to play on. Grobulus as well for the PvP. So I don't think it's that bad. Because in retail there are like a shit ton of servers that are all just linked together. I don't know what that means, but... Yeah. Um, trying to fish and reap. So it's a bit rough. Um, so, put as plainly as possible, we cannot increase capacity anymore without inviting additional and likely cascading failures of the service. At present, the best and only way to resolve this issue for the impacted realms is for people to leave the realms via free transfers. There's no technology solution to this. There's no hardware solution to this. The situation will not improve when Wrath of the Lich King Classic launches. It will only get worse. What? The, uh, this is the most doomer shit I've ever read. Like, this is what I would be saying. I feel like... Yeah, I don't know. Uh, is, is Agron an employee or... He's a game producer. Okay. I feel like that's not a great thing to hear. Like, Final Fantasy is a big game, right? Uh, yeah. I don't know if how many servers they have, but, like, I've never heard of, uh... I've heard their game goes down sometimes. But I've never heard, like, queues. I mean, I've heard queues, but, like, not like this. And maybe it's just a much smaller game. But I don't think it really is. I, I don't know. I, I guess I can't say anything about that. Um, a glimpse at the other realms in relative terms. This post is already long, but the topic of viable realm options. I also want to take some time to dispel some of the outright falsehoods about the viability of realms that are not mega realms. I like to paint a picture of how some of these realms are relative to 2008 that would have been considered completely full. So Sulfurus is four times. Atiesh 2.5. The others are two times. Everything else is like two, three times. I wish I could share exact numbers with you, but suffice it to say, I wonder if they listed all the realms or not. Like, are there other realms that are like times point two or some shit? I don't know all the realms. Um. Oh yeah, like they didn't put Blanche on here or uh, Ibiscitus or whatever I said, Erraticus, Eranicus. I wish I could share the numbers ranging from several thousand to well over 10,000 players each day on each server. Um, these realms are not queuing now. Many have never queued. He's talking about the three times servers. Um, these realms would have been full to bursting based on realm caps that we had in place even as recently as 2014 in Modern WoW. This narrative, the narrative that these huge mega realms are the only viable place to play is untrue. We want to do everything we can to drive home the absolute fact these are the greatest places to play. Any data graphic, I mean, any demographic data available on third-party websites should not be used as the basis. Whatever. Closing thoughts. Overall realm health and management, most challenging aspect of classic WoW. The mega servers emerged last year. Blah blah blah. Did you learn anything? A lot. Yeah, super cool. I mean, yeah, I mean, I don't really. I don't care too much. You I've should care played. though. You know why? Why? Because you're on a server with three hour queues. Yeah. Like right true. now, I don't, I don't even know what the queue time could be. Like if you log off, you're not coming back on tonight. And that's really scary. Like that's what I'm saying. It like, is annoying, yeah. It means like I can't go do something. I have to stay in WoW. That's not something I really want to be you know, restricted to. 
I came home, I had to wait, you know, 45 minutes. I don't cook food. I just get strawberries from the fridge. Yeah, I mean, that's annoying, and I don't know. I, I hope a lot of these people leave soon, but I don't know. Right, like, wasn't yesterday, I think, 30 minutes when I got here? And I left work early today, like 10 minutes early, and it was a 45 minute queue. Oh uh, yeah, and one of the comments says, I wonder if they're going to reopen closed realms. And I mean, they should if there's not enough realms. I don't know. And you even got someone on like the community council, which of course, like who knows what the hell they know. But they're just raging on the forums that like Blizzard is shit and they don't make it able to hold enough people. Because it's running on stuff from like way too long ago. Yeah, I don't know what the solution is. I mean, you know, obviously the problem is if they start releasing more realms, then good chance in a month or two they die. And then people complain that they're a dead realm. Or it's, you know, one-sided faction. I don't know, why not just make free transfers for dead realms? And forever. So you can just hop around? I mean, the reason yeah, they don't do that... but once you find a guild, like, I mean, the whole point is, like, to be in a guild... Well, a lot of people like to be in a guild, you just don't hop around. Well, that's what I'm saying, so like... Uh, I mean, somebody had the suggestion of making... I mean, I don't, somebody just made the suggestion of having, like, raids and stuff cross realm. So that you could be on a different realm and still raid. I, I mean, it kind of seems weird. Well, then why, at that point, you just do LFR. Uh, I, I don't know, maybe that's not the right comment. But. The whole point is you don't interact with anybody from another realm. That's why the realms exist, and they're not all linked together. And why, like, the auction houses aren't linked. Well, with the queues, you don't interact with anybody from your realm. Exactly. So, so which is worse? No, I know. But... Uh, the, the, but it's too easy to say, let's just copy retail. Because then you get like a game you don't really want to play, maybe. So then you kind of lose still. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. But then, like, you know, you get to play a game. Like right now, you know, Fear said, I mean, what do you, if you were in a three hour queue, what would you do? Well, that's what I was saying. What if you just make every, transfers? Every night you come home and you're in a three hour queue. Well, that's what I was saying. What if you just make transfers available to Dead Realms? Yeah, I mean, so, like, you're, you're, they probably should. But I don't know. I don't know how much that's going to help. Because again, if you get into a guild and you're waiting with a guild, and then all of a sudden you, you, you can't get in the queue, what are you going to do? Just leave your guild? Or Blizzard just, just pushes people. They just take whole guilds and they move them. I mean, I think that should be an option, like a guild mover. I mean, I don't know. No, I mean, Blizzard moves them. Just... <laughs> yeah. So like they should make a second like re realistically they should make a and I know this is back see the problem is right uh, with SOM right I said for for Wrath they should make one PVP, one PVE and maybe one RP. Right? Right. But I guess nobody played SOM, even though I think there was a lot of people. If there wasn't any... Were there queues? I, I didn't have a job, so I don't know if there were queues or not. Were there queues? On SOM? Yeah. I don't remember being in one, ever. Okay. So, that's why I said they should just make one server, because if there's no problems with having more people... They should just make one and everybody goes to it. One PvP, one PvE. 
and then comes Wrath, where there's too many people for one PvP. Technically not too much for PvE. But now they should make a second PvP server and just split the community. I mean, uh, yeah, or just fresh. They should do just free transfers off of this server onto another PvP server. Another fresh. And you can only do the fresh to fresh, you can't like get anybody else. But just move the fresh characters over. And then you combine them when it starts getting too low. Or you keep at you, or you always have transfers available to like the not always maybe, but if there becomes like a landslide, then you just fucking free transfer to the other one. But you have to do it on a per faction basis. That's the problem, right? Because you have two PvP servers, they're just gonna flip 100 each way. So you have to only you have to restrict it to uh, faction side. But the problem is, we're now in Wrath, where you can be on both factions. So you can't do that, right? So there's I, I don't really have a solution anymore. It would have worked for SOM, but not Wrath, where you can pick both factions. I'm pretty sure that's a thing. Right? I didn't try it. Yeah, I'm too scared to log out. Well, I mean, yeah. Go to nope, the I don't, nope. is fine. I'm not even doing it. Yeah, I mean, that's a little risky. If my game just randomly crashes and I get fucked, I ain't, I ain't messing with that. Um... Unless you you could still faction lock something, but that's kind of unfun. You could make it so people can't make alliance or some shit, but that sounds unfun because you know, I I can't make another alt or something. At least the PV years can play because they were <laughs> before they weren't even gonna have a PV server. Yeah. Imagine those guys; they'd be upset. At least they can play. Well, no, they'd be still less upset than us. Well, not if no, not if we were all. Oh, stuck you're on saying one they wouldn't be able to play, and then they'd get PVE, PVP. The like, original plan was to only have one PVP server completely. So yeah, yeah. They would have been stuck. Not only were they stuck in a PVP server, they're stuck in a queue. I don't think that was true, though. I think what that was mean, just an easy true? win. You think it was a fake thing by Blizzard? Yeah, when do they do anything that quickly? It was like the next day. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> Nothing happens quickly, it seems. It doesn't seem like a good plan, though. I mean, all the all the uproar they got from the PvE years. Yeah, and then they get all the praise. Because it, it I takes... Don't, I don't know if they got praise. It was more like, you should this, you did what you should have done. Yeah, but it's still... It, it, it eases uh, you. That's, that's no, too no. five head for Blizzard. No, it, it eases you. Because, like, they're already, like... Everybody's already fuming about anything else in the game, and then you come at them like, "Yo, be angry about this," and then you say, "Well, you can't be angry about this," and then they're just calm and they're chill. So like they were angry, and then they got angrier, and then they got chill. You just like skip all the way down. That's how stuff works, in my experience. I don't know, maybe. It's one DK per server, not one DK per side, right? Um, I don't know. Because I was thinking, if, like, Horde completely dies out, I could just maybe make an Alliance character. And kind of just crawl back into the game. I hear a rogue. I'm sapped, man. He's level 10. Well, I mean, you lasted a while there. Oh, He's level, level 10. 10. <laughs> How did he actually get the sap to connect? I don't know. But he's just gonna promise at me. Yeah, it seems. Well, this AV is popping, man. It's like I'm not waiting at all. <laughs> Dude, he's at me again. 
<laughs> That's funny. I'm immune? He was doing something, but I'm immune. Motherfucker. I guess. Do I just kill him? I don't want to kill him. I think if I kill him, he'll get angry. Well, if he's gonna f screw with you the whole time, I mean, what, what a choice to you Yeah, but maybe he'll get bored instead of... You know, you, you can't give him the satisfaction. One of their guilds is called Crusade, one of their guilds is called Hall of Fame. But yeah, I don't think there's a fix anymore to the servers. I think it's over. I think that's GG. Other than making a second PvP server. And then just having it be 100% faction imbalance. And then you just say, who gives a fuck? Yeah, I don't know. The problem, though, is like... At this stage of the game, I mean, how many people have like... Like 20, 30 levels in them and they can't get back in? Do you think they're gonna have to abandon their character? No, I guess you, you could, no, no, you you could transfer, move it. you could transfer, yeah, yeah, yeah. You just move it to the second one. Yeah, 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 no, I don't know what I was thinking. I mean, they, they probably should, I guess. Like, I think the I mean, server name is shit. I'm gonna be real. If they give me a, a better server name, I might just move. Because I'm sure there's a lot of people that aren't gonna play Wrath, but I'm like, if, you, if you're not playing here in Wrath, why would you sit in a queue? Unless you got in early during work and you just don't care, but I mean, I don't know. There, there may be this many people that want to play this fresh. Well, a lot of the problem is what you want me to do. Maybe not a lot. Ooh. A small minority, but it's still present. Oh, the remote desktop thing? Yeah, I, I, people are, right? Everybody keeps telling more and more and more people to do it. That is bad I, for the game. So it's one of those, like, well, selfish it, things. It doesn't make it bad. worse. Yes, it does. When you have, like, hundreds of people doing it, that's hundreds in the queue. But And they but, are permanently in the queue. They never leave. They, okay, but that doesn't change the amount of people that want to play. Yes, it's it just, does. It's just... I don't think so. No, because, like, if I want to play just for 30 minutes, I, I, I can't. So, like, you could come in and then leave. But instead, you team viewer early, and then you sit there, AFK, basically, and then you play for 30 minutes. So, like, you're in the game longer than you're actually playing. Yeah, but I, I, I don't know. I, I think it evens out. I don't think so. Like the capacity is the capacity. If you know, fifty thousand people want to play, whether whether they already queued or not, they're not going to get in. Uh, I don't know. But some people are just sitting in game. It's like, for example, the the anti AFK. Right, like those people aren't playing. Other people could be playing. They come in, they play, and they leave. Most people aren't doing what what we're doing here. Or I, I don't know what you're doing, but like I come home, you know, at five. 30 and I play and I go to sleep at like 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3. Most people aren't doing that. They're like, I come home at 5.30, I eat, it's 7 o'clock, I play for 2 hours and I go home or I go to sleep. But they can't play for the 2 hours because there's a 3 hour queue. Right? I think that's what most people do. But like people doing anti AFK systems. People team viewing but not playing are taking server space. I I mean I don't know maybe. And I, I I do think it is a small amount of people. I do think that I'm not gonna overinflate it. Yeah. But I think it's an issue. Yeah, I mean sure, but I don't think it would have a major impact on the queue though. I also think the queue is fake. I'm, I'm going to tell you straight up, I'm one of those people. I think the queue is fake. What do you think about that? Thoughts? Prayers? You think the moon landing was fake too? No, no. I think that a system like this cannot estimate how long you'll be in the queue. And then be correct every time. 
Well, well no, nobody. Ex I mean, I don't expect it to be 100% accurate. That's stupid. How is it even close to accurate? That, like, I don't. It should not scale with player people in the queue. It should not scale with the time of day. So many shit could fuck this over. Right? Like, Labor Day, people are going to play longer. The queue should have been longer per person. And maybe it is, and I don't know. And I don't think they're doing all this data science behind the game and figuring out the actual queue time. I think it's just like a per person queue. And I don't think it could be right. I think they're just time gating you at certain hours of the day so that you can't play as much. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, like, it's really popular right now. Like, right now might be the most par popular part of the day because it's 6 p.m. West Coast and it's 9 p.m. East Coast. So they just throw a queue on you and you either wait to play and then now it's 12 o'clock or 10 o'clock. That would be like 11 or 12. So you'll play Wait, you when it's not super popular because East Coast is going to sleep or you just don't play. So you're, you're suggesting they're purposely keeping you in the queue longer than you need to be? Like you should be able to get in and they don't let you? Well, you can't get in because the server is probably going to be full if everybody comes in. Right, so... I'm not saying I'm not saying this is a thing. I'm saying I I wouldn't be surprised in the slightest if this was true, right? Like obviously queue times are are going to pop up when they likely should, right? Like when East Coast comes home, there's more people on the server, so it would make sense that there is a queue. But I think that they're making the queue because I don't think you can time these things to the to the 15 minute to the half hour. I don't think you can time when people are gonna play. I don't think you can. I don't know. I, I just I don't see any benefit of them keeping people like keeping them in a fake queue. Like well, because the, the server's gonna explode. Getting... Like, yeah, but uh, yeah, but I don't know. So they're keeping the queue to make you leave, so you don't join at all. Well, no, or you just play it at a not popular time. So like, if you were to queue right now, it's probably 180 minutes or something like that. So that's three hours. That's twelve midnight. East Coast goes to sleep. Now you play. West Coast is active. East Coast asleep. There's not that many people. You, it's like they're they're trying if if they're trying to guess when the cap is gonna happen, if that makes sense. So that when both like sides of the U.S. are busy, or like you know not the U.S. but you know everybody. Um, when both sides are busy, it's the worst part of the day. So we need people to not be on. So we just time it so that they can play. I just... Something seems off. Like, the queue timers are fucked, right? The number goes down, it goes up, it goes down, it goes up. Like, your waiting time just flickers. Like, huge increments. I don't think they have the science behind all that. Nor do I think they would implement the science behind all that. That's why I, I doubt their data and their metrics of, of watching the data to be able to come with their conclusion. So that's why I think their conclusion is bad. That's what I'm saying. And yes, they've been doing this for many years, but I think it, it doesn't seem correct. It doesn't seem natural to me. I mean, I don't know. Maybe. I don't. I don't think people have to agree with the statement. That's why I said it's a bit of a wild take. But I would not be surprised in the slightest if they basically put a like a, a triangle on the busiest point of the day, and they they put the queue times based around the triangle. I would not be surprised because you have no. That doesn't work. Oh. But I will say one thing, and I think you have the grind set to be able to grind out the full set if you wanted to. Oh, for sure. But I, I mean, I don't know. But, but if it's AV weekend, so what is AV? Is that like 
a 50% bonus, or what? The, I don't you, know what the you bonus is. You would have to is. look that up, I have zero idea. Okay, yeah, but I don't know either. So, like, I want to do AV. So, like, people say... I think other battlegrounds might be better if you win every single game. I think that's how that works. But AV, maybe it's like a 50-50 and you get a lot of honor. Without well, kills. Well, yeah, I mean... Because back know, in the... the, problem the other, yeah, the problem with the other ones is that the, the time can be... Like, it varies how long you're in there, right? Yeah, if you get camped in Warsaw and Gulch, it's the worst. You get, like, zero honor and it takes 25 minutes. Plus, apparently it's broken, where like if there's a tie, the game doesn't end. So Yeah, so that's too inconsistent. Forever. Like, AV, even if you lose, like it, it's like 10 minutes. And you're still getting... Yeah. Like, I get, I get like 400, 500, 600 honor, even for a loss. For 10 minutes. Can you look up how much the whole set is? And how much um, you get for Yeah, I need weekend. to calculate that. I was yeah. like, I'll do that. I'm, t I'm fucking fishing. I can do that, okay? <laughs> Uh, TBC season four gear honor cost. I got it. Don't worry. Yeah, still. I guess I'll go just go resto. I'll get the full resto set, and then I'll just replace it with balance gear and in wrath. I think that's the way to go. So you're now you're resto. I know, right? <laughs> what is I was wrong gonna with do you, feral. I was gonna do feral. Then I, what? <laughs> Could, I could find myself the balance, and now I'm back to healing. But it's just so easy to get in the groups and dungeons as a healer. It seems like so. I mean, I just I just hate to pass that up. You can heal in boomkin here, I think. But what's the point if I'm not actually going to be a boomkin? Well, I don't know what you want to do. No, I'm fine. I don't mind healing. Like I, I don't have a problem with it. Trying to find all this shit. Um, uh, season four. Okay, this ladder. Season four gear cost. Uh, Thirty-eight thousand. No. No. You, That's you just for the off pieces. No, it's it's way it's reduced. Oh, re reduced. The wep the weapon's only nineteen thousand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the neck, wrist, waist, feet, ring, trinkets is thirty eight thousand. The weapon yeah. is nineteen. And the helm, shoulder, chest, gloves, legs are forty four thousand. So you need like a hundred thousand. Yeah, that, that's. I don't know if I can do that. Well, you get a thousand per win. That's only a hundred, and you get the I achievement. Mean, I mean, et cetera, a hundred seems like a lot, but if you do like ten a day, which is easy, like that's just over an hour. That's only like, it's like two hours of AV for ten days. Okay, it is not an hour. Each game's ten minutes. That's an hour and a half. Yeah, 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 yeah. like two hours. So. <laughs> But that's assuming you've won those games, because you got the 1700 for a win, you got 500 for a loss. And have you been yeah. losing every game? Uh, it's a mix. Because we won, and then we lost once or twice. I think we lost once. So that's what I'm saying, you could do it. I don't doubt that you could. I, mean, I, don't, I, don't, could. Know I, I don't. Can. I don't know if I want to. I'll probably... Want to hang? I can't do it every day. I'll hang myself. Wow. What do you mean? Why can't you do two hours a day? I could probably do two hours a day, I guess. But you know, it's just I say that, and then when I'm getting when I'm getting close, it's like, well, well, maybe I'll just play more hours. And then it turns into like four or five hours. Well, there you go. And you shave your days off. I gotta. St uh, I'm getting stupid. I'm get. I keep running in with people and I get killed. I think you take it way too seriously. I'm gonna be real. Oh, I kind of do, but it's whatever. It's not. It's not a raid. Everybody doesn't like. A quarter of the people are AFK. A quarter of the people don't know how the game works. 
A quarter of the people are already in entire gear, and the other quarter are you. Somewhere in the middle of all of that. And I'm in that same quarter, in the middle of everything. I'm listening to the very nice Iron Forge music. I've gotten 66 fishing rank ups. And they take several fish to get a rank up. It takes like five fish every rank up or something. So 65 times 5 is 325, I think. Oh, you had help. Oh, they're gonna let me die. Why do I, I do this? <laughs> Just you gotta chill. How about you just go boomkin, okay? Well, I see. I, I was just following the pack, like all the other suckers. And then I'm like, well, maybe I'll like go a little bit ahead. Maybe I'll stop and help this guy that's getting ganked by a rogue. And then that's that's my mistake. I think you gotta go boomkin and just hit people with the spells. Oh, you know what? I probably should try to use Cyclone since I have that now. Oh, no, I don't have any now. I gotta go train. <sighs> yeah, Cyclone's kind of broken. Yeah, and I'm, uh, now I'm kind of screwed because I'm trying to go through the empty lands and there's like a rogue and a drone here and just stealth and killing people. I'm just sitting here trying to get old Iron Jaw. It would be cool if I could use their fishing trainer. <laughs> yeah, right? You know, they're just neutral. They just want to fish. Like, they don't give a fuck. This guy just said he waited four hours in queue. No comment? Uh, I mean, that's a long time. And two other people just said that they stay logged in from the morning. So see? I mean I'm yeah, I'm sure it happens, yeah. But staying logged in all the morning doesn't really matter because there's no queue anyway. There's no queue until later. Well he just never logs out. So he is permanently in the game. Taking up Sure, a slot. but the time he's actually playing is the time he would have queued anyway, so whether he's in or somebody else is in, it's still the same server capacity. Yeah, but the problem is somebody else can't play it because he's in the game. 
That's the problem. Right. You, yes, I agree with that. But what I'm saying is it's still the same queue. No, the queue would be one Because if it's not him, if he wasn't in, it'd be somebody else's in, and he'd be in queue. If the no, queue no, doesn't go no, down. Yeah, no, yeah, but like that person would have gotten in the game and not been in the queue. And that, that would chain forever. So there would be one less person in the queue. No, that would be the same. It would be the same people in the queue. No, but it would be one person in the queue less. I, I don't. I don't think so. I, I don't. I don't. I don't understand. No, I don't think so. No. So if you have, if the queue is one person size and you have ten people waiting in the queue, and one person's already in the game, so there's eleven people, that one person leaves. One person from the queue goes in. Now there's only nine in the queue. Yeah, but the that's the what I'm that, saying happens. Yeah, but what I'm saying is that person that was logged in all day, if he wasn't, he'd be in the queue behind the first person of that ten. So oh, it'd yeah. still be the same queue. It'd be the same queue. It's just that guy wouldn't be in. Yeah, but he shouldn't be in. I, and I totally agree with that, but, but my whole point is it doesn't change the queue size. It's just who's getting in. The people that are gaming the system well, and being logged in all day are the ones that get in, whereas... If they didn't do it, they would get it. But the queue would be the same. The problem, though, is that the people in the game aren't playing. So, the guy... But they're playing They're playing at peak time when there's a queue. No, no, the, the guy that is, is playing the game... Oh, sorry, I did it again. The guy who is playing the game falsely is not actually playing the game, whereas... But he, but wait, he wait, is. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, no, no. okay whatever, guy. AFK guy is not playing. Other I, guy. See, I disagree, but go ahead. AFK guy is 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 using some type of tool to move him every ten seconds. He is not playing the game, whereas other loser man wants to be playing the game. And the queue starts somewhere, right? The queue ha it starts at size one, size two, three, four, five. So that first next person who wants to play the game can't play. They have. Because AFK guy is playing. If AFK guy wasn't playing, the population of people in the game playing would be a hundred percent. But AFK guy means one person in the game isn't even. It's just like, what if I just made like five hundred accounts and just threw them in the game, right? People in the game are like, if I and I made the bots AFK, five hundred people aren't actually playing the game. The the game is worse off because less people are actually playing. I see. I, I disagree because my point is, the guy that's queuing in the morning, he's not playing. Cor correct. But at the peak time when he wants to play and can get in because he queued all time, he is playing. So he is an active player. Now, if he wasn't gaming the system, he'd be in the queue because this is when he wants to play with everybody else. Yeah, but, so but he's he, not. But he's not an AFK player when the queue is actually real. No, no. But when when four o'clock comes by and the queue starts at one player. There shouldn't be a queue. But again, it, right? I, I don't. I don't know. I, at four, I mean, yeah, if he wants to play at six, at four o'clock, the queue size of one is fake, and there shouldn't sure, be a queue. Sure. Yes. It's not a hundred. Right. It'll. It would change it a little bit, but I'm saying it's not going to change it that much. There is a non-zero amount of people doing that. I mean, I don't do it. Well, I'm just saying you don't. You don't do it. So right there, you've got. I've got two instances where you're wrong. No, I, I, non zero means that other people, at least one person is. And I mean, like, people will admit to it all over the place. Well, sure, I mean, I would do it. Care. If I had to work at an office, I would do the same thing. Exactly. And that's not good. Because we stop guy who's number one in the queue from playing. Fuck that guy. <sighs> that's My so money's selfish. Just as good. But you're not playing until 6 o'clock. Maybe guy who wants to play at four, just wants to play for thirty minutes and get there's, off. There's, there's no queue at four. Uh, well, it's like four thirty or something. It starts at like four or four thirty. According well, to uh, that the guy needs to learn. You know, he needs to get a tool and No, that's way too selfish. Way too selfish. People should only be in the game if they're actually playing. It's just like the AV games. You should only be in the AV queue if you're playing the AV match. You shouldn't be in the game. Yeah, I, I agree, but you know that's not the reality, and uh, there's no way Blizzard can really stop it easily. They'd have to examine player behavior and, and 
figure out who's bot. They can't well, apparently they've already them. examined behavior to know how many people are in the queue and when they're going to leave. To give you an estimated yeah, time. With yeah, with your conspiracy theory, yeah, I guess so. Well, you but that's what that's what the that the queue says estimated time, based off of the number of people playing at this time. This is oh, your estimated time. Yeah, but like. They don't say it's exact. That the whole point is an estimate. You can't estimate something like that. Maybe you can't. Nobody can. Because you got Oceana playing on this server. You can't fucking take all those variables into account. There aren't a few people from Zimbabwe playing on this server. You just don't know. I don't think they know either. That's what I'm saying. I, I think they do. Nah. So apparently the game hides how many fish you need to catch in the achievements. F oh, no, it doesn't. Where is the fucking old iron fish, my man? I think I've caught like 300 fish. This fish ain't dropping. It's not about you, but my game is lagging. Looting is definitely different. Oh, is it? It's a little bit slower. Too many lines. Maybe they think I'm a bot, though, and they're limiting my loot speed. Maybe that's the thing. Because I have just been sitting here for hours. Uh, you know what? You may, uh... Do you not want to do that? Am I getting banned? I don't know. I would say that'd be stupid, but uh, based on what we're hearing. I don't think they ban these bots, though. I don't think they ban fishing bots. We, I mean, I hope not. I mean, there's no way they ban my account. I played SOM. But that's what everybody says it gets banned. I can't believe they banned my account. But I played SOM. And you are a master angler, first of the server. I am also the master angler. 
What if they ban the server first master angle? They can't do that. <laughs> That'd be fucking ridiculous. <laughs> Could you believe the outcry of the server population if you got banned? The whole chat would care. Your viewers alone. That's what I'm saying. The chat. Pop-Tart. This is ridiculous. Alright, I'll queue us for, uh... No. <laughs> Pop-Tart achieved. I don't even think pop tarts are that good. They're just easy. I haven't bought one in like three years, maybe. Um, I've had them not too long ago. They're they're, they're not bad. You gotta toast them. I don't have a toaster. Yeah, well that's that's a problem. I don't know if I. They're not so good at cold. I mean they're okay. I don't really like hot food. Well, it doesn't have to be hot, hot, just like warm. Well, I'm dead. Wait, maybe not. <laughs> this hunter's attacking me. Do I kill him? Uh, yeah. Ugh, I gotta stop. Last one. Okay, this level 54 is looking at me. So I don't want to hit him because then the priest will... Okay, I'm so smart to not attack. He left. I'm on the fucking front lines here. Like, you think you are, but I really am. 
you are behind the front lines. True. I'm like a Navy SEAL. Yeah, why do they why does everybody say Navy SEAL and not just SEAL? Um I don't know, just like they say Army Ranger, they say But it's like the Navy SEAL is probably a subset of the SEALs, right? Well, it's the same thing. The SEALs are Navy. Oh, are they? Yeah, they're part of the Navy. Oh. That's why they do all this weird water training stuff. I thought there was like a land SEAL and a Navy SEAL. What? No, it, it's... I believe they're all under the Navy. Sea, Air, sea, Air, Land. But it, yeah, it's kind of weird that they, they go everywhere, they're under the Navy, but that's just, yeah, I think Wait, that's is how that it is. what the, the SEAL stands for? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Sea, Air, Land. What the fuck? So the calendar has nothing for anything. The game's dead. Nothing to do. I've not been credit getting any credit for all this fish I'm fishing. It was sad. But, but it'll all be worth it. What? It, it'll all be worth it when you catch that one fish. Old iron fish, or whatever. Yeah, one thing I forgot to do last Sunday was keep fishing. <clears throat> and by the way, the fishing pools give you like double the amount as they used to. The stranglethorn thing. Are you winning? Uh, not this one. Damn. So the rumors we, are we've true. lost more than we we yeah uh, we definitely lost more than we won this time this game this night. 
Because I'm pretty sure AV... Well, like, I guess AV is the line side now, but I think AV was supposed to be, like, the only thing Horde would win. Well, I, so, I mean, I don't know. I don't have a sample size, but, like, the other night I was playing, we won, like, almost every game. So, I mean, I don't know. I think I'm probably ahead. I probably have more wins than losses altogether. Maybe the Horde's better at night. Oh, <laughs> okay. Well, I am at night. Oh, this is night? Well, I, I guess I played a little later than one night, but not much later. Also, maybe weekends are better. Uh, I mean, I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Uh-oh, some guy says... I'm just a young fisherman Fishing my way up to the town mayor I'm just a young fisherman Do you know that, do you know that song? No I just made it up Carrot doesn't work for players above level 70. Oh, really? Well, that's fine. I mean, I'll never really using it anyway. Okay, Brewfest starts in less than two weeks. Okay. Well, I mean, we hit the goal. Yeah. <laughs> we um, definitely made 70 in time. <laughs> yeah. I mean, who knows? Legitimately, if I was playing on like an our existing server, it might take that long to get to 70. Because the fucking massive queues. The six hour queues. So, I mean, I don't want to stay on too late tonight. I need to start getting. <laughs> um, what do you want to do on Grow at some point? Uh, Are you over it? I want to do it, but I also don't want to leave. Yeah, I should have suggested it sooner. I have the corpse swap in here. Like, I hope I get it sometime soon. I don't know how many fish it's been. Let's see. I started with less than 250. I'm now at 600. So it's only been 350 fish. My bags are stacked with fish. I mean, I we would have to do it together. It's not like a big deal. I always have to be there on the last day. I don't know. I think I'm gonna, I'm not gonna leave, but I might, I might switch to characters just to give, break it up, because I'm kind of tired. 
of AV. I don't know what else to do. But you haven't done your allotted time for AV today. Oh, I know, but I'm like out of. I'm already. <laughs> I need to start fresh. I mean, I'm at 17,000. That's nothing. I mean, it's a lot, <laughs> I mean, but. <laughs> That's a lot for the, is what I put into it. I don't need to go overboard. I'm thinking, yeah, I could probably get enough for my weapon tonight, but I don't want to do that. You just gotta... You have to write down the, um... Be like a thousand if you do the, you know... Yeah? Yeah, yeah, I know. But I don't think Hellfire is gonna be possible, but maybe it is. I don't know how much that one gives. Uh, that's true. And you could just PvP. Out in the open world. Yeah, that that's not happening. Well, you don't have faith in your skills? No, I don't have faith in my skills or my gear. Wow. But maybe it's actually better if you don't get the weapon. I'm thinking about it, because like, your gear's probably ass. Actually, the weapon might be good. Just go check, cause like with that much, you can buy like three pieces, right? Um, I think one of them was like five. Oh, let me check. Um, so that's nineteen. One of them was. Um, the other things are like six, seven, eight, nine, ten thousand. So you could buy like a neck, a wrist, and a waist, for example. Yeah, I mean, I guess I know what I want to do. If the weapon is better than three pieces of gear, then go for it. But you also so, might do raids and fill those slots anyway. I mean, you can fill any slot, theoretically. I don't think I want to do it. Well, I mean, I might do Karazhan, but that's like not a guarantee of good gear. No, but you could get the mace from... And I think... Yeah, uh, I don't know. I think this PvQP here is probably even better. It should be. But, yeah. Uh, the thing is, I don't even want to do Karazhan. I just want to do Attunement and the Secret Boss. That's like if it was my dream. I would just do those two. Because the Mount Drop, and then the Weapon, and the Pet. And the Quest. Keep in mind, the Quest. We have to go there. Right. Why does it give me two choices? Oh, brutal. Brutal gladiator salvation. Salvation. It's a one so you go one hand or offhand, so this is fourteen I'm sure it's the same amount. Fourteen two fifty. No. I mean the guy that I'm looking at says the Yeah, it's the same. It's the same, yeah. It's just skewed differently. It's the same, yeah. So, like, your weapon costs way more, but your offhand is less. Because it's not an actual weapon offhand. I mean, I go I mean, I mean, go from 100 spell power to 300 spell power. It's pretty big. Is that better than three item upgrades? Well, that's true. I don't know. I don't, I don't know if I want to figure all that out. We'll Plus just neck, wrist, waist. Do those. Why can't I filter on this stupid gear thing? Ah, you gotta find that shit, bro. They're 5,700. And 7,600.
see what I put in the chat. Uh, which chat? They're talking about how stuff's like they're lagging. Some, oh. some guy got the joke. So which guy are you playing? I made a shaman. Sh on the other server? No, no, on this one. Damn, full commitment. I mean, I guess. I can't, I mean... Well, I, I play Maladeth, but I kind of do that sometimes in the morning when I get a chance. I mean, I don't want to play it now. I'll never get, I'll never get back on this one. Um... What kind of shaman? What do you mean? What kind of shaman? The body type 2 shaman? No, like what spec? 
Oh, well, I mean, I'm going to level as healer, because I, th I think healer dungeons is, like, great. I mean, I'll go elemental, but I'll heal dungeons. Because I always just figured that, like, Boomkin is cooler than elemental, and Warrior is cooler than enhance. I don't know, I kind of like the... the chain lightning is kind of cool. It is cool, yes. And I like their totems, and they have the... Ugh. They have the spell interrupt. No, I mean, I don't totems. like the way they look, but I like the, you know, the way... They have a totem for everything. But then you have to press the. What's the craze about the 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 the, the fair? I don't understand. Am I missing something? I don't, I don't know. I don't know what's good about it. I'm gonna ask him. Oh, turn in decks. Oh, I'm the group leader, let's go. I guess people are turning in the decks over there. What decks? Uh, I guess they're making them already? Yeah, because you get random cards. Yeah, I know you get random. I don't really get the craze, though. I guess but maybe I, the trinkets are good, I don't know. Well, I mean, are they good? I don't know, I thought there was better ones in Wrath. Like, I thought there was, I thought there was another deck in Wrath. Yeah. I think it's already out. So you can get the Wrath deck now? That seems kind of weird. Might be a level 8. I don't know, dog. I just heard about people turning them in. I don't know. I'll be at this thousand fish in the... in no time. Let's see, I am at... Uh, I've caught about 400 fish, 450, 500, something like that. Just now. And see, this like this is good practice in a sense because this is how you get server first fishing. Yeah. Like uh, when Wrath comes out. And I'm a clicker, so you know, I'm technically behind everybody else. Because a lot of people fish with auto loot, or, or not, not with auto loot, but with like an auto recast or some shit, I don't know. Yeah, the one, I, I don't know if that one, I, I mean the one I don't usually use lets you like, you just like double right click the cast. Yeah, I don't know if that's faster cheap. though. It's definitely faster than me having to left click this thing. I also need to wait, test. Wait, you're left clicking the, the fishing skill? Yeah, I always do. Uh, I mean, okay, but you could always find a key to it, it'd be a lot faster. I thought about it, but. Not about that. Also, I just figured out you can escape to fish faster. Or maybe wait. No, yeah. I, I don't think you get the fish. If you insta recast, yeah, it doesn't, you don't get the fish. Interesting. Did you know that? Yeah, you gotta loot it. Do you get the skill though? I don't right. Think, I don't think you get the skill. Oh, I don't know. I've gotten a lot of fish without the skill. Yeah, I think you gotta loot the fish to get it. So maybe it's good that I go slow. Yeah, but that wasted mouse move from bobber to action bar. Well, I have to wait anyway really? to get the loot. Like you have to wait um, for the lag to kick in for the loot. But you have to make that move look perfect every time or you're losing milliseconds. Dude, I'm a fucking gamer, my man. Yeah, I get that, right. But, you're, but it's not about, you know, I mean, you gotta do it all the time. 
can't make a mistake. I've never made a mistake in my life. Oh, okay. Oh, I forgot. I can't check level upgrades because I'm fucking capped. That's why. Retard. Come on. What is that shit? You guys came and kissed me. I think people like me being here. I think they like the cow. To run out of space. I don't know. Simp Nation says recruiting all roles for reigning led by experienced core. What does that mean? I don't, I don't know. I thought. I thought but you didn't like they, they listed themselves as casual. Uh, well, yeah. Wait, so say that again then? They said th they're looking hey, for raiders. Oh, what did they say? I am fishing. Recruiting all roles for raiding led by experienced core. Yeah, so they're casual, but they're led by experienced people, you know? Like, that's normal. Yeah, but experienced core, it's, I don't know, that's... What, they just want to chill and relax. What do you think Lost Souls was? It was me and Siri and all you plebs. All us plebs, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so hilarious. I am in Ironforge right now, and I'm a Taran, because there's an achievement for a, getting the rare fish in Orgrimmar, which is the horde place, of course, and then getting old Iron Forge and I, old Iron Jaw in Iron Forge. So I am just kind of secretly fishing here, and some people have come by, and you know they've they've kissed me, they they've attacked me, they've whatever. But most people are just chilling. No, th this this is a pretty like weird part in Iron Forge. Nobody really comes here anyway. So, you know, just fishing, just chilling, just gaming. I've been at this for, um, like, 500 fish about. Just doing this 500 times because it's a rare. So, you never know when you can get it. You know, on the first try, you could take a thousand. Who knows? My bags are almost full of fish. Look at this, all these 20 stackers. Oh, I got a 17 pound catfish. Nice. That's a different achievement, I think. Or like part of a different achievement. Oh, I'm trying to see. Oh, I haven't caught in one of the rare ones though. Yeah. Cause I got server first fishing competition winner. Which isn't an achievement, but I mean, I got it on the other character, so I have to win it again on this character. Uh, because I don't like the hunter, I'm terrible at it, I'm the worst. Um, yeah, the milkmaid is big on fishing. Um, I, I like achievements, I'm an achievement guy. So, you know, it just kind of is what it is. Maybe I have to find out where you can get these fish, probably, because maybe... There's only certain spots, but maybe they're like this guy, where, oh, you can't see it. Maybe they're like this guy, the 17 pound catfish, where you can just get it anywhere. I don't know. Because that's the only one stack here. Everything else is 20 stacks. Oh, I got a mana pot. 20 stack. Yeah. FYI, I have a 17 pound fish. How the heck can you hold all that? Um, have you not seen me? I'm jacked. 
in game. Yeah, you are pretty big. I'm a giant cow man. But yeah, I've been fishing for, I don't, I don't know how long that is. How long have I been fishing for, do you know? Um, uh, no, I didn't keep track of it. You have to check your VOD. But nobody looks at my VOD. Yeah, that's for sure. Damn. So what are you up to, Hilarious? Still like... The, the hip stuff <laughs> the hip job my neck hurts so yeah, much yeah I'm a I little lulled by the server cause I, I mean it really wasn't that bad but I don't know I think we were ahead of this curve a lot wait what? well like as far as like pvp and interfering with everything it wasn't it wasn't that bad just wait well, I know, right? And then I'm gonna start molding again. Yeah, but you can always just do dungeons. Yeah. I don't know if shamans are good at questing or not. I assume they have no mana. I mean, it's, it's pretty much easy. And I can buy you know, good gear for her. Or at least not trash gear. Buying BOEs? Nah, I mean maybe some greens. Damn. I might go leatherworking, just craft some gear. Larius says hello. Who? Larry, don't who Larius? Who? Larius. Damn. Oh, I'm see. I see your chat. Oh, somebody actually chatted in chat. It's Larius. The Pokemon Unite veteran. I never played, sorry Larry's. I'm too old for this stuff. Nobody's too old for Pokemon, what are you talking about? The only thing I'm too old for is old Iron Jaw. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm, I'm 50, what the hell am I? See, I'm so old I can't remember, I'm 52. Larius is 35. Yeah, yeah, I'm watching. I'm actually watching your stream. Oh, shit. You're watching the fishing? Yeah, this is such exciting content. Dude, this is big. Just wait until the achievement marker pops up on the screen. See, see you're, you're doing this wrong, you know. What you should be doing while you're fishing is you should be putting up a video and reacting. True. That's where you get the viewers. I don't think anyone's going to scroll down long enough to find it, though. Everybody loves react videos. What am I going to react to? Then say something super, super based, so it makes live stream fails or something, and you're set. I already did. I said the cues are fake. That's, that's, that's minor. Nobody cares about that. I care. The cues are a rough part of life. He says you're older than dirt. I th I can read. I'm not you know I'm not that old. Well, I don't know what you're doing, your shaman. Maybe you're just drinking water. Larius wants me to react. I guess. Is that what you, like? What do you guys want me to watch? Everybody loves to react. Fine, I'll do something. Just give me a second. How am I supposed to fish, look at the chat, and react, and not accidentally miss? The, the confirm to collect old iron jaw when it comes. I'm definitely going to miss it. I'm, it's going to drop and you I'm going to just fish again and it's going to go away. I'm going to be distracted. You don't have auto loop? It doesn't work. It's it's a it's a bind on pickup. So you have to you always have to confirm bind on pickups. But, but you're a gamer, you'll make it. Oh. Well the, the problem though is since I'm in Discord, I'm not listening to your stream. I won't hear the video. Well, you're going to have to just mute me then and watch the stream. Yeah, I can do that. <laughs> you're going to have to be a viewer. Okay, is, are you okay with that? You're going to have to be a viewer. Uh, I mean, I'm a viewer now. You're going to have to watch this stream. Uh, bolstering the numbers. 
hundred percent. Um, let me well, let me see what videos are on YouTube. But I think yeah, I think in thirty minutes, eleven, I'm gonna just do on girl, and I'm probably calling it. Damn son. Yeah, I can't I can't do these late nights. I mean, we're we're done, right? It's time to take it easy. Yeah, I want to, but at the same time, I want to give me some old iron shot. You know what I'm saying? No, I mean I get that. I mean you can do whatever you want because you still got a mine and stuff. Why do you keep bringing that up, dude? <laughs> I know you want to level your engineering, but you don't have to remind me every hour. Jeez. Yeah, I gotta start buying some stuff. You know that mining doesn't get enough for engineering, right? I'm not gonna have. I tried to give you shit, and you just f forgot. Apparently, I, I, I did. kept saying I had a whole bank. I said it like ten times. All those, all yeah, those extra that, bronze that bars minor. down the drain. That was just minor stuff. The mithril is where it gets serious. I'm not gonna get enough. Well, okay. not by fishing and iron forge, you're not. Okay, here, I'm gonna react to this Pokemon thing, okay? Is this good enough for you guys? Pokemon? Yes, my no. queen. No, no, please stop. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna mute. Here we go, react. Oh, wait, I gotta, I gotta listen. Okay, so I have muted and deafened, okay? You should say a binch? What is a binch? Uh, is that a word? Okay, I can show this, right? Yeah, okay. Wait for it. I don't want to cover the fish part. Is, is this big enough? I don't want to cover the fish. Like... <laughs> Thank you, Larius, for not using the lurk commands. I don't even think there are lurk commands, but thank you. I think you meant to type bunch. That's what it's the bench is not a word. Okay, so here we go. React and fishing. Okay, that's Peach's Castle right there. You see that shit right there? Peach's Castle, Mario 64 is coming to the Pokemon. It's gonna be, you think about Scarlet is red. That was really loud, holy shit. Scarlet is red. Mario's hat is red. That is Peach's castle. They copied, right? They got the three pi three spikes, right? Let me show you a picture here. One sec. Peach's castle, Mario 64. Check this shit out. You see right there? Three, right? One, two, three. They fucking copied it. I already know before it's coming in the game. Easiest clap of my life. Is this really loud? Oh my goodness, a motorcycle in the Pokemon universe. Who could have expected that? They haven't been tweeting about it for weeks. Oh, that crab was kind of cool. Is this a Krabby? Is this a Krabby, but like in a different alternate universe like the Alolans? Who fucking knows? You son of a bitch. Thank you. Look at these graphics, though. They're still on that same... The same graphics of uh, Arceus, which I was playing, where... It focuses on like this one crab who's really low res and this till looks like absolute ass. Like what is going on here with these shadows? Like it makes the shadows make sense but also at the same time this rock goes in and then out and then in again. Physically that just doesn't make sense. Also like this the sun is over here, the shadow d literally doesn't make sense, but we'll go past. Also like yeah, the shadow is way too thin. It just doesn't make sense. Okay. We got this fire dude, aka the new Pokemon from the tweet today. This is a new fire dude. It's the exclusive to the Scarlet version. There's a purple one that has a sword. Keep that in mind for you out there, gamers. Big stuff coming. They're going. This the, the theme of this Pokemon is going to be all about resource environmentalism, right? So they got windmills, they got fires, they got the purple guy with the sword all about conservation right there you see the sword dude oh, I rewind it far too far but it's okay we're going back to the motorcycles this is an electric motorcycle what the fuck am I doing I'm doing an infomercial for this whole game <laughs> I don't know but this is an electric motorcycle we got some Sheps out here 
Big stuff. Huge. You hear that noise? That was the crab. Go, Argh. Woo, look at this. A new feature. It's called a map. You can look around your surroundings and you can put markers and it'll tell you where certain things are on the map itself. So you know where exactly to go. You can rotate the map if you want. You can move the map. You can zoom in and out. Big features coming to this game. Never seen them before. Set as a destination. Flags. Starfall secret. I miss. See, I just missed the fucking fish, dude. I didn't even click the fish because I didn't hear it. Because the rap All Star, aka the Arcanite Ripper that they're playing, I couldn't even hear it. This guy's got star power. Again, a Mario theme. Star power. If you've ever played Paper Mario 64 before, you know about the star power. There's 10 stars, or 9, nine or 10 stars you have to save. And then you can defeat Bowser. By breaking off his invulnerability spell? Wait. Fuck, I thought that was it, man. What the fuck is this dude? A bloated mud snapper. What is that? It's not even an achievement fish. The fuck? Oh. Wait. Does this have old iron on it? I'm deleting a lot in case it opens a lot. Here we go. A single gem. Omega roll. Back to the Pokemans. We're Team Star. You notice how they're zooming in on the chests? You see this shit? Sexist pigs. And they're kids. We're Team Star, kid. We burn too bright to even look at directly, but you knew that, right? What the fuck? Also, what's up with people in these ties that aren't... Just, they're just not doing it. They're just not doing it correctly, right? Their ties are too low and they have the button open. Like, just take the tie off, people. Please. It's an embarrassment. They're also on the Great Wall of China, FYI. Remember, China is huge on energy conservation. They have the wall. They're also about safety. That's why you'll notice they have motorcycles. And motorcycle helmets with two stars on them. Two stars is for the second star in Paper Mario, which is all about energy conservation. Team Star, once again, stars, shooting stars, natural gas. You also build Habitat for Humanity. But we're not gonna have these machines that build things. We're going to build it ourselves. And look at, what is this graphics? Like, I don't like hating on Nintendo for the graphics, but what the fuck is this? This looks like it came right out of Ocarina of Time with this, this brown shit and the grass around it straight ripped from it. The color is just odd, too. You see that? Like, it kind of, like, fades and it's see-through and it's literally flat. You can see it's, where, what, like, oh, we got some little bit of spikage here. What is going on? These dudes are trapped in the fucking house. You get the fucking what what is this the the coffee pot, right? The hot chocolate. Oh, this looks pretty hype though. Did they bring the combat from Arceus all the way over to this game? Wait, belt? What is a belt and road? Larius, you are too cultured for me. I apologize. I don't know what a belt is. But back to the game. We gotta fight off against this dude. This is why it's called Pokemon Scarlet. Because Guy Fieri comes out of his flaming hot car and we gotta beat him in a Pokemon match. Or wait, never mind. It's a cat girl without the cat ears. Okay? Prepare to get messed up, says Mila. Mila Kunis also. A fan of environmentalism. See, it all just comes right around. It really does. She's also got a great ball. Great balls cost less attempts than pokeballs. Environmentalism. We're not wasting, right? Because think about it. 
when you break a Pokeball, you can't use it again, right? So you better be ramping up the type that you're using or else you're wasting minerals. It's like, for example, if I were to sit here mining for thorium, I put that shit into engineering. You know, I don't just delete it from my inventory like I did with this fish. Fish are overpopulated, though, so it's good to keep their numbers down. Just know that. Boss of Team Star's fire crew. Oh, we got a Torkoal. A huge one. A huge one coming out here. Torkoal is a great Pokemon. He has no uh, evolution -y or evolution. He's just a Torkoal man. He's dope as fuck. But what's up with the graphics? You know, like, this looks... When, when something when smoke comes out of something, it's not just a... Pfft, like, a, it's not something tangible. But this looks like you can touch the smoke. That's a problem. This is not what we want to see. Like, look. It looks like he took a shit in the air. We want to see smoke. This is not smoke. Also, you can see every single line in, in this whole thing. Like, no fish are hooked. What a lie. Oh, yeah. So, little, little chocolate, hot chocolate's going to take on Mila? I don't think so. Flame Wheel, a huge move. Flame Wheel, is, I think, what carried, um, what is his name? The Monkey Dude? That's what carries the monkey all the way to top tier. This guy's fishing. Blood Wars. A level 33 human paladin. I'm going to wave to him. And I'm going to get back to my fishing. Okay, Path of Legends. Uh, so you got new legend, Herba Mystica. He is a crab. Why is it called the mystical herb? Who is this guy? Don't tell me that's Professor Mir. I hate Professor Mir. Oh, dude, now he's fishing right next to me. My man. Oh, I forget what hat that is, but it's like a green. My man. Look at him. We're fishing together. Oh, you can't see because the... But look, my man. My man. Arvin. Wait, what was his title? One moment. An upperclassman and a gifted cook. Wow. I need an Arvin in my life. If there's anybody that wants to cook for free for a guy who should probably cook for himself but can't doesn't have very good taste buds, just let me know and I'll hire you for free. Sheesh, man. 1.4 million views. Nintendo L PS5. Where is it in my house? Me and her are going to be too busy visiting the, the liars, layers of titans and nabbing the Urbic Mystica. Who the fuck wrote this? What, like, 40-year-old mom wrote this script? This is shit. Where is the, haha, you're a nerd, now I'm going to fight you? That's what people want to see. What is this shit lore? It's almost as bad as Shadowlands. Let's be real. What the f oh is that the green starter that's fighting the Urba the legendary? Why is there four legendary Pokemon right next to each other? There's only supposed to be one legendary, my man. Like I don't know what to tell you. There's only supposed to be one of them. And there's four right here in a desert. Why is there a sand desert crab? This is not uh this starts with a C. You know what I'm talking about. It's like uh crunch. It uses it, it's its signature move is crunch. You know what I'm talking about. It goes into the Dragonfly, whatever that Pokemon's name is. Come on, what is it? Yeah, I make good sounds. What is that? What is it? What is it? Uh, the orange dude, he uses Crunch. He, he has like just, he looks kind of like an ant almost. What is it? It goes into the Dragon, it has, it's a three-stager. No, not Yanma. Oh, that, okay, well that, that's a good guess. That is a Dragonfly. But the orange dude, yeah, Trap Inch, and it goes into Trapilly or whatever, and then it goes into the Super Laform. It's like they, the Trap Inch is now a legendary, but it's just a crab. Like, come on. There's Trap Inches fucking everywhere. Nobody's, nobody gives a fuck. This is a Trap Inch. Let's be real.
They already have Krabby and Kingler. Why'd they make another one? Like, just make Kingler legendary or some shit. What is that? The Stony Cliff Titan cl Cloth. What the fuck is this? What is this? Okay. Look, this guy fluffs his hair. Oh shit! Dude, something just happened. I gotta fluff my hair out of my face. Like, what? what is this? Well, can we come back to the 2D games, please? This is ridiculous. And that thing's the Stony Cliff Titan. No cloth has got any business being like what? How did I not catch any fish? Yeah, dude, that little dog man is dead. Oh? Pokemon Stadium music. Huge Pokemon Stadium music vibes. Huge. Let me let me let me get to Pokemon Stadium theme song. I don't think there was a. Th I don't think this was anything before this right here. A classic. Ba 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 ba. Wait for it. We're gonna dim down and then we're gonna come shoot back up. Just wait. It's gonna go. Da -da 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 -da. What a classic. Now we go to the classic music, the classic blue, you know, Omelette Du from Blue. That wasn't really the song I was thinking of, but it works. Okay, we got that classic. Okay. Uh huh. Okay, the opening. These are such good songs, right? They're simplistic. They're made for gamers. I don't know what to say. Oh, this is when you win. Hall of Fame. When you beat the game and you get this, you're a champion. You're a champion! Champions! A little fun fact, this is one of the songs that helped me learn how to whistle. I taught myself how to whistle in middle school. Because I'm a gamer, okay? You see something, you know it's achievable, easy clap. You guys are welcome. I know you haven't heard a beauty like that in quite a while. My voice is gone though. 
I say all the time, I have such a weak voice, and it's already fucking gone because of that little bit of whistling. Back to the video. We got Gita. Do I know how to swim? Yeah. A lot of people don't know how to swim, especially in my area. But I know how to swim. Because, like, there's beaches everywhere. You gotta... And, like, my, when I grew up, we had a pool, so... Yeah. Pokemon League Chairwoman Gita. Uh, Japanese? Nobody can read this. Hello? I know that's not Japanese, though. Okay, I understand. <laughs> a trainer who shows you the ropes. Nimona. Why does she also have a tie? What's up with people in the ties? Can we just chill for a sec? Like, they're not, they're not wearing anything that... It's a three-button shirt, except it's literally got zero buttons. Why does she have a tie with leggings? Like, can we tie? <laughs> what, like, hello? Like, what is going on? Also, she's got a fucking dual disc on. What is this shit? She's ready to fucking whip it out. <laughs> Throw some cards and shit. What is that? Seek out the sun flora. Okay. What the fuck is this emo ass guy? Grass type gym leader. Yeah, super effective on that, that water bird. That's also super effective. Flying on grass, super effective. Pseudo Wudo, ground. Rock is really good against flying. And he's fucking crystallized. This is a new, a, 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 a world first premiere. It's not even world first, because how do I already know about it? You crystallize your Pokemon, and they become a different stat type. Check this shit. Damn, he's got a motherfucking ass leaf. And what the fuck was that shifty shift? What was that? Was that sword dance? One second, I got a fish. Was that sword dance that he used where he shuffled in place? Look at him, he's going to shh. What the fuck? Trailblaze. What the fuck is this? Now we got the eco efficiency. I bet you can fly too in the game. Check this out. Oh, you see that? Am I a fucking wizard? Look at that shit. You know, the water with the. Oh, flying. A hang glider. Okay, hear me out. Blizzard and Nintendo, they got some shit going on together. Faux Rizzle. This guy's in the Goldshire Book Club. I feel like Alliance has cooler names. Well, like, maybe not really. Alliance has real names of, like, clubs. The Horde has, like, Abomination. Fuck the hose. But, like, Alliance has actual names. Oh, look, a little Night Elf Druid. Moonfire Spam. Interesting. But Blizzard, if you don't know, their, their, their premium, like, pay-to-win mount is a hang glider. Any suspicions by anybody else other than myself? I'm gonna wave to this dude because he's fucking gaming out of his mind. Uh, I think not. Whoa, what was that shit? Hello, Mudkip? Do you guys see this? Mudkip? No, that's a whooper. A dirty ass whooper. What is going on here? Is this a different form? What is that bunny man? That bunny thing looks kind of cute though. I would put that bunny on my team. I don't know. I can't tell what that thing is. A monkey? Is that... That's not the monkey with the tail. I don't know. What the hell? I guess it's a new Pokemon. I don't know what this reptile guy is, but he's hitting that, 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 uh, the shroomish pretty damn hard. Polo t-shirt with a tie, let's go. <laughs> was that mine? No, that was their fish I heard. He's playing some music though. He tail swipes with music. Okay, they also got the, um, is that the Hopip? Right? That's the Hopip thing? They got the, is that, that's not Cinderace, no. What is that bird called? Is it Cinder? No. I don't remember what that's called. Oh, damn, they got the dude, though, from the movie. They got the dude from the, the Third Eye movie. Uh, it's not, it's not Dronaxis or whatever. Ah, they got the dude from the Third Eye movie. 
Um, it, when they get when they go to the uh, what is it like Moon Mountain, Mount Moon, right? Mount Moon, I believe. They go to Mount Moon. They they resurrect Groudon, and then this motherfucker. The, the, he's he's only he's only I think he's only dragon. Yeah yeah, he's pure dragon. He's not even flying. Fucks him up. Real deal. With the Flygon. That's what it is. Trap Inch goes in the Flygon. And the the, the Flygon beats the, the shit out of this blue guy. And then maybe they team up to both hit Groudon. Some shit happens. Talonflame. Yeah. And I forget who the this guy is. But, you know, he's aight. Whoa! You see that, that zoom though? Check this shit out again. One more time. You zoom in and then you zoom out. And you change from body type 2 to body type 1. You don't even notice. Check this shit out. Body type 2 to body type 1. Damn, son. And there's the fire dude. And there's the, the, the sword mace, man. My inventory is full. I don't know what the fuck is going on here. Okay. Uh, by the way, whenever you do these things, you go back to this. You go back to the intro. FYI, if you didn't know. Zombie Groudon. You don't know about zo Zombie Groudon? Or do you know about Zombie Groudon? I don't have any fish. I'm just fucking dumping all this fish out. I can't hold it. I still only have one rare fish out. It's not the fish I want. Someone's gonna tell me that like he's just not it's not even in the game or some shit. Someone's gonna tell me. This dude I've caught like six hundred fish right now. Dude ain't even in the pond. I can't get levels because I haven't bought the higher level of fishing. Cause I don't wanna have to leave and then death walk like eight times back into this place. Holy base cigario. You don't know about the main series games? Or the movies anime, I guess? Ugh, dude, you're missing out. Um, Groudon Mount Moon. Movie. Yeah, see? Virus Groudon. They resurrect him, but like... I don't want to spoil it. Jirachi, that's what it is. The third eye Jirachi. Right, look, we got Ash, Misty, Brock. Who gives a fuck, kid? Unreleased BGM. What the hell is a BGM? Deoxys. Yeah, these are different movies, but... What the fuck is this? I don't remember that. Actually, yeah, I do. They were in the rink. Yo, check this shit out. Have you guys seen this movie? If not... New battles unfolding. Pikachu versus Charizard. Rematch! This is the scariest shit in the world. Look at this. Rock this place. Okay. It's doing some light. Yeah, and you got like the 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 black kid who's raised by the Asian father, who's like terrible. You never want to go into these things. I think he's got a Pikachu. I don't win this time, okay? What are you doing? What is your plan of attack? I don't operate according to plans. Maybe they're both black, but they live in Tokyo or something. Everybody speaks English. Oh yeah. So he's huffing up. They have some. It's kind of a, not really a spoiler, but they have some some cheating gas. Which it's kind of like uh, if you know about uh, weightlifting when they they smell the whatever it is. It's just the same shit except this makes them fucking. Now, See, he's on crack. I've dealt with this Motherfuckers before, on crack shit. So I'll just do it again. Give me my hands back. They just chugged a year's worth of that R stuff! Hey, 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 hey. It's like you said, okay? You did it before. You just gotta use your powers. You can use quick attack, discharge, or electro bulb. <laughs> like, what is this? What am I looking at, man? <laughs> but I think Volt Tackle is your best move, so start with that. First of all, when did you learn how to be a Pokemon trainer? And secondly, get me the hell out of here! Begin! They need the money, dude. Get the fucking win. Get the W. W's in the chat. 
for critical hit. Use Volt Tackle. Volt Tackle. What is this cringe shit? Go for Thunderbolt. Come on, you got it. Oh shit, guys. Uh, you got to use the fishing. You got to use the fishing. Oh my goodness, crit on the fishing proc. Holy base cigar. Tiger's eye from the old mouth. Raw brilliant fish coming out of here. Like, what is this? I'm so tired or else I would seem enthused. Fucking this no sleep regiment ain't working out. My body is collapsing. I can't do it when people are watching. Can everyone just look away, please? It's not working. I forgot how to use my powers. But he didn't. <laughs> the fuck was that? Oh yeah, the Loudrids are dope as fuck though. You see that shit? The anim the, the the fluffy Loudrids look super cool and evil. Is my bobber not going, or am I missing it? Thank you, Larius, for the W in the chat. You don't want to do this. I'm adorable. Pika, pika. <laughs> Dude, why is the bobber not going? Am I missing these all or like what? What are you doing to my baby? Get out of the way! Uh oh. Uh oh. That's not good. A mana pot, classic. So everyone's ingesting. Oh, the loudrids are going off. Have a magic harp. Oh, dude, a lickitung! You see that shit? My man lickitung came out of the like no. Well, look at this dude. He licks her ass. Damn. More action than any of us get in 20 years. Damn, son. Oh, that golem, that graveler, my bad, looks dope. The guy you were looking for wanted to know the source of art. <laughs> it comes from the doctor. That's all I know. But not me. Oh. <laughs> see, they put lore into the game. Fuck that. I just want to see the Pokemon's fight. Ooh. Nice catch, kid. Let's get out of here. I got a plan! What? That's not gonna work! Magikarp is the worst! Magikarp can evolve into Gyarados. All it needs is a little kick! Water in the hole! <laughs> in my head, I saw that differently. Uh. But now you have an evil Gyarados. So hey, was that? I don't float. Wasn't the Gyarados just like uh, what's it called, dragon some shit? Useless. Oh, Nita's back online. Oh no, my goodness, a green northern sword, short sword of the strength. Oh shit, look at that dope shit though. Shush. What is that? Silent. Are you happy? I'm not good at reacting because I'm like mega tired and I don't like doing it. Yeah, uh, well, I mean, it's pretty safe. He's level 70, but he could die. So he could die. By the way, my Death Knight only has one piece of gear. <laughs> from the original <laughs> DK starting area and you can tell which one of this, right? I'm sure you can tell which one of this. Which piece of gear is? Is it? 
I'll wait. Actually, I have two pieces, my fucking bad. I have two pieces. Uh, no, it's not the horns. It's not the fishing pole. Guys, come on. I believe in you. The horns do look legit. That's why... That's why this is one of the rare times I'm actually using a head. I almost always uh, keep head and cloak off. I still have the cloak off, but I almost, uh, it's not a bad guess. I was worried that you'd pick the head, and you did. The left and right shoulders, yes. The shoulders are the Serenite plate spalders. And all the Serenite gear is the, is the tier 2 starting area DK gear. You start off with something... And then you get the, the, the Serenite gear. Do you know what the other item is? Oh, fuck. I pressed fishing instead of actually collecting the fish. That could have been old Iron Man himself, and I just missed it. Holy shit, man. Do you know what the other item is from the DK starting era? I don't blame you if you don't know it. 100%. I don't blame you. Check this shit out, though. I got I got something for you. Okay. The relic, yes. Except it's a sigil, my man. I'm not a paladin. <laughs> I'm an undead, reborn, revived paladin. With frost. I'm basically a shaman. Except way cooler. Well, what is it? We get next to you say this is a bow? It's a motherfucking ass gun? Is a crossbow? It's an idol? Do you, is this relaxing? Do you feel like you're about to fall asleep? Or do you feel aroused at my amazing looking body? It's one of the two. And they're both great. You'll notice I don't have a shirt and I don't have a tabard. Shirts are, if they feel kind of useless, right? Like the shirt wouldn't show like anywhere. The tabard, I might use the, um,. I might use the uh, Argent Crusade one, but I guess it's not Argent Crusade it's still. It's still the Scarlet. Or no, it's still the Knights of the Silver Hand. Whatever they go into. Argent Hold, Argent Dawn, Argent Dawn. Larius, you don't gotta lie to me. I understand that, like, I'm fucking jacked and mega cool looking. You don't even gotta say it. You know what else you don't gotta say? That I've caught over 600 fish in a row and I still have not gotten old iron jaw it still ain't coming out my man and you know what that's what odds are when you get into a queue and you're one in 10,000 people your odds are that you're somewhere in the one in 10,000 and you just sit there and you go home and you hope that you're number one when you get to the DMV and they say caller number 3T and your far Q, and you don't even know what that means? That's because you're looking in the wrong department. Different desks have different letters and numbers associated with them, and they scale differently. And you gotta find the right clerk to look at, to watch, to ponder, to think. Why am I here? Do I really need my license? Can I drive with an expired one? Maybe I should up also update my address, because that's my old apartment. That's the things you got to be thinking about to be a gamer. To be the best, to catch them all, these are the types of things that have to be crossing through your mind. Meanwhile, you're fishing, and you're the best fisherman in town. You're also the only fisherman in town. This pond right here is the only place you can fish in, aside from apparently, and I don't know if people are trolling me, they say you can fish in the lava. I don't believe it one bit. I think this is the only place you can fish in Iron Forge. Of course, you can go to Stormwind. It's basically Italy with all of its canal systems. This is the place to go. This is where you want to be. And this is where, hopefully, eventually, old Iron Jaw will be. 
I do not need to try the lava. I feel like it's a troll. And it just means that I will die and become unresable and I'll have to get res sickness and lock my ass all the way back here and die six more times. Because the res is right outside. Primal Mooncloth bag. That's big. Massive. 20 slaughters. I get 8 slot more per. Pissed. He wants me to please send him a tell. If you did not know, PST is not pst as in like pst. It, it means please send tell. When people ask for whispers, you should say no, I'm going to tell you. Because it's PST. Please send tell. The lore master is here. Don't worry, I got you guys' backs. These guys are just here to play. They just want to play the fucking game. They're doing both PvP, player versus player, PvE, player versus enemy. In Wrath, aka Wrath of the Lich King, aka WLTK, or Waddle K, as I think a 19 pound catfish. I got the 19, I got the 17. There's probably another motherfucker on the hunter in the bank. What is going on? Where is old Iron Jaw? You know what I'm saying? Sheesh. Let's see, with the DPS, 9.1 DPS. If this is retail, this would be cracked as shit. Yeah, dude, a 19 pounder. Now I got a 17 for myself and a 19 for my lady. We're gonna be cooking tonight. Wait, actually, why is this not? Okay, yeah, yeah, I get it. I see, I see, I see my errors of the ways. I see the errors of my ways and all the days that I'm doing the pays. What I want to see again is another sickly, sickly mud snapper. I want to loot some great shit out of its mouth. Last time we got a tiger's eye. As you can see, it vendors for a solid silver. It probably goes in the auction house for three silver, okay? You can't just make this shit up. Nodi has been watching me. See, he's an Asmongold viewer, right? He's in the free Hong Kong clan. He aspires to be the kind of streamer I am because I am a better streamer than Asmin Mall. okay? That's what he's looking for. He's taking notes worthless. He's not looking at me because I am worth full. I am not this dude. I am going to achieve great things. Soon enough, I will be achieving a thousand fish, okay? A lot of people dream about getting this achievement. It's not something you can just do on the fly. You gotta earn it. You gotta respect it. You gotta respect the guy who got server first fishing, Stranglethorn fishing extravaganza. The literal winner. First, server first. I came in with like 200 fishing skill, okay? Not even a shot in hell. I easy clap that shit like left, right, front, and center. I came at it. People know. Everybody knows. My YouTube video, let me show you. It is so popular. It's actually popping off. It's probably my most successful. Fuck. One moment. Give me the fucking music back. It's probably my most successful video to date. Let me tell you. Let me tell you, yesterday, it had zero views. Today, it has. Two viewers. Massive. For an event that only took 13 minutes to win, or something like that, a 30 minute video on a 13 minute, more than half of this isn't even related to it. It's useless. I put it there because I wanted to remember the beginning, far before, and the far after. Okay? Two whole views. Some might say my career is popping off. Some might say. You might not want to watch it, Hilarious. There's, there's nothing that really happens other than I fish and I win. I'm a gamer, and that's what happens. You know, not everything is flashy out there. But what you got to know is the heart of the cards, right? 
there's certain cards that you're dealt in life, certain things that you're great at, certain things you're shit at, the worst at. Anybody can beat you. You're a trash sailor. Oh, you got the f you got five bird feathers. Nice. From zero to two is infinite expansion. True. That's the kind of vibe we're getting here, Larius. This video will one day have at least two million views. Come back in like ten years, and look at that video in ten years. It's gonna have two million views. I don't doubt it in the slightest. It's the biggest achievement that anybody on this server will ever have. There's nothing on top of it. Server for 70, who cares? They just took Adderall and you didn't go to sleep and you played for five days straight. Who cares? Who even asked? But this thing, okay? Server first, Stranglethorn fishing extravaganza. This. This is what life is about. That is a real damn good achievement. It's skill, it's luck, it's, it's all of it together. Preparation. Coming in hard. I sacrificed getting my DK early that day. Or maybe that day at all. Oh yeah, getting it. I sacrificed getting my DK early that day. Getting prepped for that shit. I was ready. I came on him like a bird in the wind. I got a tailwind coming at me. And I'm going right at the plane. Nothing is stopping me. Those, those engine jets, I don't give a fuck. I'm going right through them. And I'm coming out a winner. I got my, my turkey. I got my turkey in the bag. Ain't nobody coming close. This is how it's done. This is how you game. This is how you game. Look at this. In the meantime, we've already caught like 25 more fish. We're closing on the thousand. I've caught over... 650 fish. Yes. I'm all the way up. Nothing can stop me. I'm all the way up. Are you referencing that song? Because that is a good song. I just, I would play it, but I don't want to ruin the vibe we got going on now. It's like I'm a tiger. The eye of the tiger. I'm a champion. I can't be stopped. Nobody can stop me because I'm all the way up. My man is still selling Primal Mooncloth bags. If you need one, it'll probably cost you about 30 gold, give or take some. That's my guess, my gander. Lineups for mage food. I know it's free, but the bureaucrats have fucked up the distribution. I don't know what this guy is saying. This dude is selling these for 45 gold. Yikeronies. Who is paying that? I bet a lot of people are paying that. There's a lot of people that pay with the wallet. You know what I'm saying? They uh, cha-ching, 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 and they get massive amounts of gold. You know this 534 gold? It's been earned through hard dedication. Leveling up the hunter. Playing the hunter. Using the pet. So much gaming intensified in this 534 gold reserve. I got all the bags filled out in the bank. I think they're all eight slaughters. I got, actually not on the DK, the DK. Actually, yeah, maybe he has all eight slaughters. I think he does at this point. We got 12 slaughters out the rip coming here. You can see these bags sell for zero silver, zero copper. These come with the death knight. You don't have to get them separately. The game just says, hey, we understand you just leveled a hunter all the way to 55. And hey, that ain't so easy, bruh. We're going to give you some bags. We're not going to start you off like a level 1 pleb. We're going to give you some bags. That's how you game. That's how it's done. That's playing to win, baby. That's how it's done. Meanwhile, you got fuckers over here buying these flying kite looking asses. And they're just going cha-ching, cha-ching, cha-ching. Don't look at this serpent. I fucking hate it. Don't get me wrong. I may have done the swiperoni in the past, but at least now I understand the errors of my ways. They call me Obi Wan Crash Novi because I did it wrong and I fixed it right up. Look at me now. I got the Northern Sword Sword of Strength. Do you know the drop rate on this thing? It's finitesimal. It is finitesimal of a drop rate. 
know, you just, you can't be like this without the grind set, right? It's called, you got the Sigma, you got the mindset, and then somewhere in the middle there, you got the grind set. And that's how you come, and now we're at 924. You don't just scale the fishing meters by being a pleb. You gotta break out and make out. Right? Who are we making out? We're not making out with chicks. We're making out with our fishing rod. My fishing rod, as you can see it, it's nothing special. It is the default fishing rod purchased from the fisherman, salesman, and orgrimmar in the Valley of uh, Valley of uh, er, Valley of Honor, I believe it's called. He gave me this fishing rod, and I'm the only one here in Iron Forge fishing because you know I'm legit. Hey, you know the haters will tell you nobody's here because this is a shit pond. I'm here because I'm on the grind set. I'm right now in the Valley of the Fishy. You might say the Forlorn Cavern Alliance Territory. That's why it's in deep red. If you didn't, no fish are hooked. What the motherfucker? What? That was my man right there. That was him. That was old Iron Jaw. I think the game is actually broken, and I'm not even shitting you right now. That was old Iron Jaw. I could tell. Okay, I will potentially see you tomorrow if I don't stream all night and fall asleep. Because the stream is not turning off until I get the old iron jaw. Because I am not coming back to the shitscape that is Iron Forge ever again. Except maybe for some zombie invasion fun. Who the fuck knows? Fuck around and find out. But this guy, look. I've caught 700 fish. 700 fish people and this is the type of grind set that gets you server first master angler server first max fishing and wrath this is the grind set to match the mindset and if you take one word it's the grind set not all of us can QAV all day you know you win some you lose some you get turtled on they instantly kill Drac whatever nobody cares fishing is where the game's at surfers hospitalization nah bruh it ain't that bad I ain't trying to go first to 80 nah fuck that shit bruh you only need to get server first I need to be level 68 and to uh, you know have like 350 fishing I'm about to clap them cheeks you know what I'm saying Throw that shit out the window. That shit ain't coming close. I'm getting raw off small fishes for days because this is training me. Training me to get the trash that is out there in life. You come back from a day at work of doing jack shit. I don't do anything at work any day of the week. You come home and you want to play some WoW. You want to fish some achievements. You want to get old Iron Jaw. And this is where you land. You land in Iron Forge, in the Valley of the, S the Fishes, and you sit there. You cast the reel. You cast the reel. You cast the reel. You cast the reel. It keeps going. It keeps going. You just keep fishing. You know why? Because that's the mindset to match the grind set. That's how it's done. You think I want to have all these fish in my inventory? Sure, I like me a 17 and a 19 pound catfish. Sure, I'm down with that shit. No big dealio, McTerialio. And sure, the Northern Short Sword of Strength is a dope weapon. Damn, just check out this motherfucker. Look at him. D -d 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 Damn, D -d 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 Daniel. Sheesh. This is what you get. These are the rewards. I also got the Tiger's Eye from that murky, big mouth mud snapper. This is how you play WoW. World of Warcraft, it ain't about killing people. It ain't about if you're Horde, if you're Alliance, if you're in a Rathy Basin, if you're in fucking Dun Monroe. It doesn't matter what's going on in the world. All that matters is that you're fishing. 
because the fishing achievements are by far the most exclusive achievements in the game. You think anybody ever fishes like this in their life? No, they just do the cha-ching, 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 and then they buy the fucking food. That's what they do. Nobody's out here doing the grind. Nobody's out here with the mindset. The fishing grind set. You know what I'm saying? It takes a huge man and an even bigger brain to be able to do this. It's not, you don't just walk in to Ironforge and say, I want to get old Iron Jaw. No, no, no. No, 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 no. You got to have the mindset to be able to get him. It doesn't just come naturally. It's built over time. How many years? So many damn years. But maybe you're a cookie, cookie, uh, cookie clicker kind of player. You know, that's fine. As long as you get the mindset from that and you transform that. You reallocate it. You take the supplies. You twist them around each other. And you say, now we're a fisher. Now we're fishing. And you just press the button. The rod goes out. The bait's there in the water. You're about to collect it. You click on it. You're going to eventually get old Iron Jaw coming right down the sails. And it goes down your windpipe and right into your bags. And at the end of the day, that's what fishing is. That's what it is. You just got to keep doing it until you get it. I'm going to check in a second how many fish we're at. We're at 955 fish. Over like 750 fish caught in a row right here. You're watching it first. This is the life of a man who becomes server first. You don't walk into Strangothorn Vale say, oh, do 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 do, it's about time to start the tournament. No, you prep it, you grind it, and you win it. A three step process. First step, you prep it. You gotta practice. Fishing ain't easy, okay? If anybody tells you you just go to the causeway and you just throw your rod out there, no, it ain't easy. You gotta prep it. Number two, you go on the grind set. You say, this is my tournament to win. This is mine. I'm not leaving until I win it. And then the third step is collecting the rewards. Because obviously, if you've gotten past the first two stages, you're doing something right. Something is clicking. The cogs are returning. Coggers, as they say. Things are happening. The world's a changing. You look around, the sky is a nice blue color outside. Things are working. Things are good in life. And you pick up the rewards. You pick up the trinket, it turns you into a fish. And you say, easy fucking clap. This is my zone. Stranglethorn, this is mine. I own it. And that's what I'm doing exactly here. Ironforge, do you see anybody else here? I'm in Alliance territory right now. They could come around and attack me. But I ain't scared. I'ma be here day in and day out. Ain't nobody stopping me now. This is my zone. The Valley of the Fishes is my zone. This is where I live until I finish the mindset. You know what I'm saying? The mindset completes when the grind set is over. When you get the reward. When you see it in your hands. For me, it's old Iron Jaw. When he comes into the bags, when he says, do you want to loot it? I'm going to click OK. And then we'll get out of here. But that's only when I've achieved the mindset to match the grind set. I could eat these fish, right? I could eat all these fish. Ain't nothing stopping me from doing that. But the only thing that's going to stop me from leaving is catching old Iron Jaw. And that ain't coming easy. Because it has been basically assessed that I have currently not met the mindset. So here I am proving that this is mine. The achievement will be gotten. Whether it's the thousand or the old Iron Jaw achievement, one of them's coming. And I'm going to keep fishing. It don't matter if it's day outside or it's night. It don't even matter. I am straight fishing. And I am killing this bitch. You know what I'm saying? Look at my man. He looks awesome. 
He looks a little bit cracked out of his mind. Here, I'll bring back the actual weapon. A fishing rod. Because that's all we need. This is what, what I am right now. I am a fisher. There's nothing about it. I fish. You fish. He, she, we fish. Did you try turning it upside down? Probably not. Because you know what? This isn't always about Spongebob. Sometimes it's about real life. And real life is a mindset. Some people will say you do the grind set and it becomes your mindset, but that is just boring. That ain't gonna happen. You're gonna quit. You gotta start off with the mindset. The mindset allows you to have the capability of turning on the grind set. You know, it's like it's kind of like a trigger. One day you feel it. You know you've surpassed yourself, your prior life. Everything's going okay. It's just you gotta turn that switch on, you gotta find it. For me, it's being a fisher. The only thing I know how to do is fish. And I, like I said, we're about to hit it, 976. About 750 fish in a row, right here, right now. I don't even know how many levels that should be, right? I capped out on getting levels so long ago. I've been stuck at 225 for hours. The next thing, someone's gonna tell me that you can't even get old Iron Jaw over here, and I'm gonna tell them they're wrong. I'm gonna tell them that this is how you game. This is how you get old Iron Jaw. There ain't nothing in life other than fishing for me right now, because that's my mindset. And I'm gonna keep the grind set stuck to the mindset, because that's how you improve. That's how you show. You show the haters, the doubters, the doomers. You show them all that life ain't no hop, skip, and a jump. You're not out in the in the, the back of the school playing hopscotch with all your friends, right with the feet going boom, do, 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 do. You know, we're playing a real man's game. The real man's game, what is it? It's wow fishing. This, this is kind of, you know, some might say an end goal. Right, there's nothing, there's nothing greater than sitting, catching, absorbing the knowledge from the fish, right? It's not specifically catching the fish, you'll see. I catch and I release as well. Catch and release. It's about the knowledge that you gain. Do you have the fortitude to keep doing it all day and all night and everything he sees is just blue like him? Blue like the water in the pond. People talk about they want to play player versus player. Player versus enemy. The guilds will advertise, we're the best raiding team in the world. But you know what they ain't got on me? Server first, Stranglethorn fishing extravaganza winner. Server first, baby. That's a number one. You can't take that shit down. You can't add numbers to that. Nobody gives a shit about who came second. You know why? Because the game's fucking bugged and it lets everybody else win too. But that's a fucking bug. And I got that shit on record that I am the server first. No doubty Chris Chowdhury. This is just the game. Right here, chilling, fishing. Look at this rod. It is a basic rod, and I can still whoop anybody's ass. Anybody's, no doubt. I put that buck 50 down on my face. This is a man's game and a woman's game. It's everybody's game. Anybody can be a fisher. But is it the mindset that you have right now? Does that incorporate fishing into it? Because not everyone can do it. Not everyone can be nine fish off of a thousand fish, getting over three quarters of it all in one sitting. And I don't take any drugs and no paraphernalia up in this house. I'm just a guy who tries to game and be the best that he can be in the game, right? So the mindset, fisher, grind set, backing up the fishing, that's just how you do it. It's nothing crazy, there's no special formula. You don't go to the gym, pump weights, you sit inside, you eat your frozen dinners, and you just fish. That's really, at the end of the day, that's what you gotta do. You gotta fish up the 17, the 19 pound catfishes, the tiger's eye, 
two mana pots, the northern short sword of strength. This, this is the struggle, right? You might go into like a raid, fight a boss, takes you down a couple times, and then you kill it. That's whatever. No, nobody's nobody's watching that. What people want to see is the grind set. It's showing enthusiasm for something that you enjoy so much that it challenges you to your inner core. That's what fishing is. That's what people should go for in life. It's not some easy way out. You don't you don't just go ch ch take the train all the way down to Georgia. You don't do that. Life's about the process. The process here, of course, is fishing. How do you become a master fisher? You get the mindset. Why do you get the mindset? Because you want to do it. Because you want to be an achiever. You want to get the achievement. Right here it is. A thousand fish. Easy. A thousand fish down. Over 750 caught in a row in the opposing faction's waters. Still, I have not collected old Iron Jaw, but one of these days, my man is going to come out and he's gonna give us the best demonstration I've ever seen in my life. 1K, baby. Is there another one? Does it keep going? It looks like that's the max. That's as far as I can go. The next achievement, Check it out. The next achievement, I'll be here all day, all night. And everything is just blue. Everything he sees is just blue like him. Inside and outside. Old Iron Jaw. It even says right here, all the haters are going to hate. Fish up Old Iron Jaw in Iron Forge. And as you can tell, I am swell. Sitting in Iron Forge. Look, even Iron Forge. It's simple as that, baby. This, this is fishing. Some people think fishing is a fool's game. You're not gonna get anything good. You're gonna get shit because you're shit. Nah, that ain't how this works. You fish because you wanna fish because that's the best of you. People talk about living your best life. That's what this is. There ain't nobody that's meant to be a fisher more than me. I'm out here doing the fishing. All the other haters, they're just going. Ch -ch 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 -ch. They don't have the the mental fortitude, the superstitions, the cast bar that I have. You know, they they change their UI. They try to make it all fancy. They use macros. They use add-ons. They use other tools to make fishing easier to cheat at the fishing game. I ain't about that. I'm about the default lifestyle because this, this is the grind set right here. And when I created my mindset, it was to match what I knew would be the grind set. I know I can feel him. He is in the water somewhere. Maybe I can smell him. Maybe there's some sixth sense going on. But I know he's in this pond, and I'm going to find him. There ain't no more number of fish for an achievement. There isn't. Simple as that. Easy ass Cracker Jack. There ain't no more achievements I can get right now. The only one is Old Iron Jaw. And I'm going to be here. I'm waiting. Nobody else is here. You know why? Because they ain't on the mindset. They can't even fathom what it is to think like I do. To say, hey, you know what? I'm going to fish, and I'm not leaving until I get the fish. They can't think like that. And I understand it's a pretty rare take. Some might say it's a hot take. Some might say I'm blazing. But I'm just paving the wood for the others to walk on. You don't just take boats and have them sit in the water. No, you put them on a harbor. And you build that harbor with manual labor and nice pieces of wood. How do you think you build the harbor? 
with those two things and a mindset to make the best harbor you can make. If you're sitting out there and you're like, you know, uh, my boats are, you know, they're, they're kind of falling apart. I need a place for them to sit. If you, if you say that and you buy some shit product, it don't matter how good you are. It's going to be a shit bridge. Nothing's going under or over it. Boats are tall. Sometimes the boats, the, sometimes the bridges got to open up in the middle. Let that boat through, you know? Put the gates down, the cars can't go by. Open that shit up. Sometimes people just don't understand. It's about the process and the inputs, right? If you think about it, you have the rectangle, which represents the process. You have the arrow coming in, the inputs, and then the arrow coming out, what is that? The outputs, and it relies on two things. It relies on the rectangle and the arrow going in. If you try to cut the line, it's just not gonna be the same. You're making a whole nother process. And you don't wanna go down that road, because sometimes you'll make it, if you're building a forge, let's say, and you're using the wrong metal, guess what, you gotta tear that down and build another one up. And we're not talking about walls. We're talking about real sturdy structures. We're talking about, you know, what are you gonna do in this world? Fishing. Fishing is what everybody should be doing. Look at the patience that I have. Nobody can catch as many fish as I have in a row, in a session. Nobody can do that, but I can. Why is that? Because I've trained myself. I've gotten better every year. I know what needs to be done. I know what should be done. I know when it needs to be done. I know how to get it done. All the steps are done. Everything is completed. You look at the quest log, how to get it done, when to get it done, why to get it done. It's all completed. It's all there. There's nothing to think about. There's no work for anybody else to do. It's all on me to put it together through the machine. I got to use the arrow and the rectangle to get the other exit arrow. It's all on me. I can't rely on others. You can't do that in life because some people will let you down and you will look like a fool. If I told somebody, hey, can you fish me up a old iron jaw? They might go, oh yeah, sure, pal. I'll do it, no big deal. They come here, maybe maybe they fish 100 fish. Maybe even 150. And, and you know what they're gonna say? Ah, man, I, just, I don't have enough time. I'm not feeling too great. I got a headache, this is boring. That's what they're gonna tell you. But you know what I'd say? Yes, I can do that for you. Because I've done it before in my dreams. Anything you think of that's obtainable will be in your imagination. And the reverse is somewhat true within itself. If you dream something to be, you can make it. Obviously there are some things that are illegal. Maybe you're not going to Mars. But aside from that, there ain't nothing in life but a nice fishing rod. It just goes great. Sitting in the valley of the fishes, relaxing, just chilling, cruising, relaxing, maxing all cool, shooting some beat ball outside the school, and then a couple of guys. Oh wait, no, it's just me by myself here. There's nobody else. It's just me, the Taran Death Knight made a death knight within a week of the server releasing on a PvP server. Do you think people can just do that? Do you think I just got that, that mindset out of nowhere? It came from the fishing. The fish give, the fish taketh, and then they give again. That's how it works. I've trained with the fish. The fish have trained with me. We are a unit. And at the end of the day, that's what we're hoping for. You know, you can't always sit there and say, you know, I want to do something and I, I want I want some some combination effect going on. Some communalism, you know? 
It's not... You can't just say that. You gotta do it. Me and the fish, we have a great bond. That's why I say... Any day now... We're gonna catch old Iron Jaw. There's just no doubt about it. Because we have a bond. The fish and I... I've been doing this for so long now. I don't even know how long it's been. It's just been way too long. Some might say... But I'll tell you, it's been not long enough. I still have a lot to learn. My mindset might be fantastic, but I'm not perfect. I got some flaws. I understand. Life is life. Things are going to be changing. Sometimes you catch this fish. Sometimes you catch another fish. Sometimes you catch a third fish, or maybe even a rare. You might get a gem. You know, a tiger's eye is nice. You might get the Northern Short Sword of Strength, which is, is uh, you know, as we've already shown, really cool looking. A nice purple hilt, green diamond, and then just, you know, a classic sword look. Nothing crazy, but it's good. It's all we need. You may also get the 17 or the 19 pound catfish. And you know what those are? Small trophies. You didn't win the war yet, but you've won a battle. That's what's that's what happens. I've won a couple battles here. And I'm trying to push through the enemy forces. I'm trying to say I got the fish. Nobody else has the fish. I'm here. I'm ready. I'm presenting myself for the fish. And what is greater than that? Some might say eating a milkshake. Some might say, I'm sleeping. Some might say, getting your jaw fixed. But fishing is where it's at. If you're fishing, you're in a good mood. There's just no doubt about it. You can't be mad and fish. That's not a thing. The only thing you can be in life while you're fishing is enlightened. You're learning. You're becoming a learner, as they say. There's just nothing more to it. You either die a fish, or you become the fish. That's how it works. That's what was passed down to me, that's what I'm passing off to you guys. Because remember, what is it about? It's about the mindset. The mindset then follows or then it's followed by the grind set and then you get the results think about it for a little bit let it let it just sink in like a nice uh, roast meat bun you know you know what I'm saying let that marinate feel into your fleshy brain hopefully it's wrinkly we need wrinkly brain men out there those are the smart peoples not everyone has a wrinkly brain though so watch out sometimes Sometimes you'll find yourself in an altercation with a smooth brainer. And no, I'm not talking about mind soothe, I'm talking about mind smooth. Sometimes you have to talk to these people and it may not be the best. It may not be the greatest in the real time. But you know what? When you put the arrow into the box, you might get an amazing outcome coming out of the other arrow. That's what the goal of fishing is. Fishing gives, it takes, and then it gives again. So you get the circular Zandalari effect. And really at the end of the day, is there anything else that you need? If you're getting this, this type of sphere action going on, that, 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 that's fine. You know, we don't need anything else in life. It's all good. Don't worry. We Gucci Mane. Oh, see, there you go. Another mana potion. That's exactly what I wanted. I'm a, you know, you might say, but you're, you're a Death Knight. Why would you want mana potions? It's not always about getting the mana potion. Because it's not about me. There's other people that could use these amazing. You walk around downtown. You hand out some, some lesser fishing. Lesser, lesser mana potions. You know, it is what it is. 
sometimes people need to understand their place. For me, it's not about me being a death knight. It's about me being on Sky Fury. There's other people that exist on Sky Fury. And I'm sure they could use this potion. Right? If we look at it, it only sells for 90 copper in total. Do you think I need 90 copper when I have 534 gold plus? The 90 copper isn't the big deal. It's the same thing when you give a gift to a friend or someone as a family or, or even a stranger. When you give a gift to somebody, it's not about the gift. It's the thought that counts, as they say, right? That's the phrase. Did you think about them? Did you think about what they like? Did you try to get them a good gift? That's all that matters. Everything else is fluff. It's the same thing with fishing. You fish, you pick up the fish. Sometimes the fish isn't perfect. Sometimes it has other items inside of it. You gotta open that up and get it out. It is what it is. It's not crazy. It's not the end of the world. Sometimes you just got a game. You got to put the goggles on and you got to say, what's up, my brother man? And just throw that rod out and hope you get something. Because at the end of the day, What's going to happen? Nobody knows. Nobody sees this going on. Quite frankly, I'm not even sure they'd care if you told them. Oh my goodness, this guy is fishing. But that's not, that's not the point. The point is that you care. The point is something happened in life and you moved forward. You got the northern short sword of strength and you move forward. I can give that to somebody else too. Because it's not just about me, it's about the server. If people start leaving the server, the server will collapse. Guilds might not be able to do anything together. The game might go away. You might never be able to play this game again. So what do we do? We give the sword to a trusty steed. And they can do whatever they want with it give it to somebody, they can say it's ugly, they can keep it themselves, they can do whatever they want. That's just the circle of life. Right? You eat something, something eats you, then something eats that something. That's how the game works. Because that's how you game. I hope this is all making sense. It's definitely on the verge of reality and some of these things might be you know pretty complex thoughts pretty different ideas I understand but if you get even a little bit and you think about it it flows it's got the jello like mellow all these fish in the bag they don't represent failure they represent partial success some of these things were rejects, but I took them in. So that makes them a success, or at least a partial success. Ain't nobody gonna tell you, oh, leave the fish alone. No. Everyone's gonna say, the fishing, we need fishing because there's too many fish. Let's feed them to the bears. Let's, let's do this with the fish. Let's, let's let the fish do this. But well, why don't we care about the fish? The fish have lives too. They're living beings, right? We sit here fishing. Fishing for what? My four watt is turned off. Sometimes people will say, well, I like to fish, but at the same time my friends don't fish. But that is just an odd remark in my opinion. A 19 pound catfish. Now we have another one. Wow. So this is the first one, the second fish, and the third fish. We are gaining on our catfish game. 
Still zero old iron jaws, but you know what? We've gotten three big catfish. Some might say massive catfish. Because that's what it is. Sometimes. Sometimes you don't even have to game the game. You can just be yourself. And no, nobody, nobody tells you that's wrong. Because it's correct. That's why nobody says it's wrong. If someone tells you it's wrong, you told them their life is a terrible mistake. Because they didn't end up like you. As someone who's on the mindset. And someone that's on the grind set. That's the problem with people today. A lot of people look and they say, oh, you haven't achieved this. Or, you know, well, what, what is this? Why do you say this this way? But they fail to mention that everyone's just human. People are going to make mistakes. Ain't nothing wrong with making a nice mistake here and there. Nobody's going to attack you. Things happen. But you know what happens a lot of the time? This health stone goes unused. It happens way too often. I played AV two or three games right tonight. And I didn't use the health stone once. I've died for sure. For sure, for sure. For real, for real. I've died. It is what it is. It happens. But I got to use the health stone. There ain't no doubt in my mind that the health stone should be human nature. Not formed by humans. But made for humans. You know, when you're sitting there in a war sun gulch and someone starts hitting you, just pop a potion. They'll probably be shocked and say, oh, I don't know what happened. This guy is hacking. He's cheating. But no, all, all that happened was he popped a potion. That's it. Nothing changed. You're the same person as before. There ain't nothing going on here. No sus shit happening here, my man. And it is what it is. Sometimes you just get the old swapper room. Sometimes they, they come looking at you and they say, You got too much fish, my man. You gotta calm down. I think this is a problem. You know what I say? I say no. I say I'm here to get old iron jaw. Is it gonna happen? Who knows? Should it have happened? Yes. There ain't no way that this is getting away from me. It's not gonna tell me my progress, I assume. I've already achieved it, so it'll be up here. So yeah, it does not tell me what the point of fishing is. Obviously, there's a lot of good stuff in Wrath. You can get the fish feast, you can just buy fish, or you can, you can sell the fish I meant. You can also get the turtle mount. You move faster in water, I believe. But it might be a 60 ground mount instead of 100. So it's slower on land, faster on water. I think it's one of our cooler mounts, personally. It's just a giant turtle. But yeah. Nobody's gonna come in this house and tell me what to do. I'm the lord of the land. What's gonna happen? I'm beginning to feel a little bit of doubt, to be honest, with this. This might not be going perfectly. There, there's some definite, definite loopholes going on right now. Like, maybe you can't even catch the fish over here. Maybe you have to be in the lava. Maybe I'm just getting unlucky. Maybe I have to be farther into the pond. Who knows? But what I do know is that WoW is all about fishing.
can't remember. There's a reason for the grind set. If I give up now, you know, like, what am I? Should I even just turn the stream on tomorrow if I give up? I'd be a whole different person. But I made a promise. I'm gonna see it through. If it means I have to not do certain things here or certain things there, I gotta change up the lifestyle for it, that's what it is. But when you say you're gonna do something, it's gotta get done. Can't be hiding behind pictures. You know, you can't go lying to people. A lot of people will lie, but they won't even think twice about it. But I have a moral compass. I know, I know the things that are good, what's bad, what's good. You know, what it do, homie? I know what's up with that shit. I know all about it. There ain't no doubt in my mind. Ain't nothing gonna stop me. Cause I'm not number two, I'm number one. I am best fisher. And again, if you tell me the achievement doesn't exist, I'm going to just tell you you're wrong. You might, the only thing I would accept is if Blizzard says the achievement isn't working correctly. That's all I would say. You don't catch as many fish as I have in my day, but I believe in liars. The grind set ain't for everybody, you know? Some people are, are a little bit weaker willed. Maybe less talented. Who knows? But... I'm a gamer, so I'm gonna keep gaming. That's all I know, that's what I'm used to. That's the life I do, that's the life I live. I messed up there, I'll be honest. I don't know if the, the, the bobber hit or if it hadn't hit yet. I just felt like clicking it. If you notice, we're getting a lot of raw long jaw mud snappers. It's not exactly what I'm looking for. It's not really the highlight of the day.
That's the fake tier two helm, I think. It's got the same model, but it's green. I feel like I'm being tested. I'm being tested. I understand. This is what it is. The guy's gotta be here. Fish up old iron jaw.
is frost steel. What is that?
the mailbox. You know, I don't know, honestly. I don't see a mailbox, though. So, I don't want to leave this area. It was a good idea. It was a very good idea. But if I leave this area, there's guards on the other side of, like, these exits. There's, like, you know, like, uh, arches. There should be guards on each side. Take the mailboxes for you now. I gotta figure out, I gotta think about where they are. The problem is the mailboxes are probably right next to like a billion other guys. Let's see, I put these back on. I gotta put the slower one in the front. Yeah, so like I can't kill the, I can't walk by that guard. Oh, see, I'm dead now. I'm actually just dead. I think I was dead anyway, maybe. Is there a mouthbound mailbox, anybody? Yeah, there's cars right there. Yeah, I'm just dead. I'm gonna die in a safe spot. Oh, I'm out of combat. Yeah, I can hearth. Sorry, there's no... mailbox I can use. But I can still send them all fish. Dude, look at them. Five stamina. Wow. Maybe the other one does that too. So let's see. Everyone that's... they want this but they're getting it um, I, I don't think I you don't know about this um, Larius but I can't actually stick with this guild which is a shame they seem like nice people but um, the problem is that I'm playing on a west coast server and I'm on the east coast Their raids would be like from 11 p.m. to 2 a.m. on the weekends, which obviously I am awake for, but I, I can't guarantee I'd be awake and alert at those kind of hours. So I am going to have to leave this guild at some point.
Yeah, yeah, this is the server I won the tournament on. I actually got in this guild because when I won the tournament, the guy asked me, he's like, hey, do you want to join? And I was like, sure. Um, but I didn't ask when their raid times were. So they raided like 8 to 11. But it's Pacific Coast time, whatever, Pacific Server's time, Pacific Standard time. So. Yeah, there's just not much I can really do about that. Um, and, like, there's some guys that are, like, you know, like, level wise. Um, so, like, they got a bunch of 70s. So, like, it's like 10 maybe. So they have a bunch of 70s already, which is cool. Um, but I can't, I can't read that late all the time.